situations can be there. But the moment you lose the ability to speak to that situation, you are finished. Situations cannot kill you if you still speak. If you don't address the situation, you cannot dress up the situation. Your ability to speak to a situation addresses it to redress it. Wow. But many have digressed from knowing how to speak. Matthew 7 7 says, Ask, seek, knock. ASK, ask, he still says, Speak. Welcome to our third night of our five nights of glory. Somebody shout glory. glory. Yes, the Lord is good and ever so faithful. We have seen the first night. We have seen the second night. We're now in the third night. The third night is the night of power. Hallelujah. So people of God, wherever you are, just begin to just glorify the name of the Lord. Just begin to give him all the adoration and honor. Amen. Father, we thank you for today. Amen. And please also, those online on YouTube, please be sure to tell somebody, to tell somebody, to tell somebody we are live. And welcome those online or those in the house. Turn to your neighbor and say, Jesus looks mighty good on you. 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 Hallelujah. People of God, let's just lift up our hands as we reverence the Father. Yeah. Father, you are glorious, ever so mighty, Lord.
You make a joyful sound unto the Lord. A joyful sound unto the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It is our night of what power? Hallelujah. 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 I don't see the excitement in the house tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I said, let me see. Let me hear a joyful sound in the house of God tonight in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Praise the Lord. We serve Almighty God. Amen. Amen. It is our night three. Amen. Yes, sir. We have been waiting. Amen. Amen. We've been waiting the whole year for this moment. Hallelujah. Right. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. If you have your Bible with you tonight, amen. Amen. I want us to pray, but before we pray, I want us to read the word of God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. If you have your Bible, please turn to the book of Exodus. Exodus to chapter number 24. Hallelujah. We're reading from 15 to 18 before we pray tonight. I'm reading the King James Version. Hallelujah. Verse 15 said, And Moses went up into the mount, and the cloud covered the mount. Hallelujah. Verse 16 says, it said, And the glory of the Lord abode upon Mount Sinai, and the cloud covered it six days. It said, And the seventh day, the Lord, the, and the seventh day, he called unto Moses out of the midst of the cloud. Amen. Amen. Verse 17 says, it says, and the sight of the glory of the Lord was like a devouring fire on the top of the mount in the eyes of every children of Israel. Wow. Verse 18. It says, and Moses went into the midst of the cloud and sat and got him up into the mount and Moses was in the midst 
in the mount for 40 days and 40 nights. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Glory be to the reading of the word of God tonight. Hallelujah. We have been waiting for the whole year for just this moment. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Has anybody been waiting for this time at all? Yes, Hallelujah. If you've been Praise. waiting the whole year, let me see you wave your hand to Christ Hallelujah. tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise Hallelujah. I know you have been waiting. Amen. Amen. Because you have been expectant. Hallelujah. Amen. It is our year of what? open door hallelujah yes, and we have been waiting for 2024 mm. because by the time or from the time the prophet of god declared declare that this year our 2024 is a year of open door Amen. i know some of us can wait hallelujah Praise lord i want i want to get into 2024 Amen. because i know for sure that 2024 is going to do me good hallelujah Amen. 2024 is going to do you good hallelujah and 2024 is going to do the heaven global church a good, good in the name of jesus hallelujah hallelujah so tonight we're going to pray just as the children of god waited and so you have been waiting the whole year hallelujah hallelujah so it's time now for you to experience the power of god amen it is time now for you for you to see the glory of god hallelujah so tonight we're going to call upon the glory of god to descend upon this gathering hallelujah mightily like never before hallelujah to somebody shall heavenly father heavenly father heavenly father as i begin to pray oh lord let your, glory Let your glory descend now, descend now upon, us upon us in the mighty name of Jesus. Name Somebody Jesus. lift up your voice tonight and, and cry for, to God for the glory of God to descend. Heavenly Father, as we begin to pray, oh Lord, let your glory, let your glory, let your glory, let your glory descend upon us, oh God, upon the heaven, upon the heaven global church, upon the heaven, oh God. Let your glory wrap us Somebody lift up your voice wherever you are, online, in the house, wherever you are tonight. Lift up your voice, oh God. Lord, oh God, let your glory, let your glory, let your glory let let your glory let your glory descend tonight father let your glory let your glory let your glory Father, we are calling, we are crying tonight, O oh Lord, for your glory, for your glory, for your glory to descend upon every man, those online, those in the house. Father, we are calling. Rapaka Sokata, Labraka Sokata, wherever you are watching from, wherever you are watching from, we are asking tonight for the glory of God, the glory of God, the presence of God. Rapaka Sokata, Rapaka Sokata, Rapaka Sokata, Labraka Dabakata, Rapaka Sakata, Rapaka Sakata, Labraka Sokata, for in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray. We're going to cry tonight. Let your presence change my life. Amen. Hallelujah. We always say that better, there's a song that says better is one day in your sight. Hallelujah. Than a thousand elsewhere. Oh, yes. So because of the presence of God, because of the presence of God upon us tonight. Hallelujah. Father, let my life be changed. Hallelujah. Oh. Let your presence change my life tonight. Amen. I don't want to go home the same way I came. Hallelujah. Amen. If it is that disease, Father, as your presence take over this auditorium tonight, as your presence take over the homes of those that are watching online tonight, yes, Father, Lord. whatever problem that your people have come here with tonight, let your presence consume now, oh God, every every power now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let your presence consume every sickness. Yes, Let Lord. your presence consume every worry that your that your people have. Amen. Amen. So we are crying tonight, Father. Let your presence consume every problem that I came here with tonight in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The somebody shall Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. As I begin to pray. Oh Lord. 
Let your presence consume every worry tonight in my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody lift up your voice tonight and cry to God. Heavenly Father, as we cry tonight, oh God, because of your presence, because of your presence, consume now, oh God, every worry, every problem, every issue, every oh Kabbalah Basatala. Father, we cry tonight. Basatola Bakata. Father, let your prayer, let your presence, Rakota Basakata, let your presence let your presence oh god because of your presence tonight Father, let your presence Raposha Katalabaya Lebra Kasakata Father, let your presence consume, oh God, consume, oh God, every issue, every worry, every sickness, every stagnation. Rapoko Sakata consume tonight, oh God, let your presence, oh God, Rakalaba Kasokata Lebra Kasokata. Father, let your presence, O oh God, as we call upon your name, as we call upon your name, Rapa Kasokata, Lebra Kasakata, Lebra Kasakata, Repa Papa Kasakata, Labra Kasokata, Lebra Kasokata. Father, let your presence, O oh God, consume tonight, Rapo Sokoto, every sickness, consume tonight, every issue, consume tonight, Raka. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. And as the Bible continues to read, it says, And the seventh day he called unto Moses out of the midst of the cloud. Hallelujah. So we're asking God, Father, call the Heaven Global Church to a higher dimension tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Call John and Newman Ministries to a higher dimension tonight. Amen. Call the people, oh God, yes, that have gathered here, not online. Father, call them to a higher dimension tonight, Amen. oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say so somebody shall Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father. As I begin to pray. Begin to oh, pray. Lord, oh Lord. Call the Heaven Global Church. Call the heaven global church to a higher dimension. To a higher dimension. Call John and Newman Ministries. Call John and Newman Ministries. To a higher dimension. To a higher dimension. To a higher dimension. Call the, people call the people that have gathered here, have gathered that here, online, online. Call, them call them to a higher dimension. In the mighty name of Jesus, somebody lift up your voice tonight and cry to God for a higher dimension of the presence of God, for a higher dimension of the glory of God, for a higher dimension of the power of God, to a higher dimension of the favor of God, for a higher dimension of the presence of God. Lift up your voice, O God. Rapaka Sokata, Rapaka Sokalabasha, Rapaka Sakata, because of your glory. Rakasha Katalabaya, Rega de Gadegade, Rapaka Sokota, Rapatabada, Rapasha Kalabaka Sokota, Rapaka Takata, Rapaka Sokota, Rapaka Sokota, Rapaka Sokata, Lebragada, Father Oga, call us Oga, to a higher dimension because of this gathering as we have gathered here online, O God, in your house, O God, Father, we are crying for a higher dimension of your glory a higher dimension of your power a higher dimension rapaka so katala riko baba shakata rabroka sakata for a higher dimension rabadabada reka shakata lift up your voice and cry to god that god shall call you to a higher dimension call me oh god to a higher dimension call me oh god to your mount oh god to that secret place Rapa Kashakata Rapa Dabada Call us O God Rapa Shakata Labaya Rapa Kashakata Rapa Kashakata Call us O God To a higher dimension The heaven global church Your people O God Rapa Kashakata Labra Kashakata Rakata Bakashakata For in Jesus name we pray Amen 
Amen. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. We shall now again welcome. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Let us welcome the praise and worship team. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Come on, praise the Lord. Come on, come on. Hey, hey, hey. Your hits. joy of the Lord is my strength. Though sorrows may last for the night, His joy comes in the morning. I'm trading my sorrow. I'm trading my sorrow. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. trading my shame. I'm laying them down. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. I'm trading my sickness. I'm trading One more time, stay there. Trading my sorrow, say it. I'm trading my sorrow. Yeah. I'm trading my shame. I'm laying them down, I'm, I'm laying them down. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. We say, yes, Lord, I shall. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Yeah, 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 yes, yeah. Lord. We say, yes, yes Lord. Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. We say, yes, yes Lord. Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Hey, Jesus. Yes, Lord. We say yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Amen. Trading our sorrows. Come and say. I'm trading my sorrow. My pain. I'm trading my pain. I'm laying them down on the horse. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. I'm trading my sickness, my pain. I'm trading my pain. I'm laying them down on the hold. I'm laying, I'm laying them, them down, down on the hold. To the joy of the Lord. We say, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, yes, Lord. Yes, yes, Lord. We say, yes, yes Lord, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, yes, Lord. We say, yes, yes Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, yes, Lord. Amen. Oh. Yes, Lord, no, 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 no. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, Amen. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Are you ready? When I call your name, 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 come on. We love, we, we love, love to call your name. We say, it's something we cannot explain. explain. What happens when we proclaim we say, your great name? Your great name. Your great we love to, we love to yeah, yeah. call your name. It's something cannot we cannot explain. explain. We say, we say, what happens oh, when we, we proclaim we say, your great name? Your great name. Your great we love to call your name in something we cannot explain. Oh. What happens when we proclaim your great Your name. great name. We love to call your name in something we cannot explain. Oh. What happens when we proclaim your great Your great name. When I call 
call your name when I call your name Jesus when I call your name 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 come on give God the praise 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 Give God the praise. Come on. Give God the dance. Give God the dance. Oh, give God the dance. Give God the dance. Great Jehovah, ruler of everything. My defender. You are the most I can. Great Jehovah, ruler of everything. I call you my healer. You are the most I can. Great Jehovah, Great Jehovah ruler, ruler of everything. In my defense. You are, you are the most I like Say, Lord, you reign. Lord, you reign. I shout. Lord, you reign. Lord, you reign. We say, Lord, you reign. Pray, Jehovah. Your hands, your hands, your hands, your hands, your hands, your hands. Hey, hey. Come on, teach it. Come on, teach it. I have no reason to fear. I have no reason to fear. The Lord is my life. Oh, the Lord is my life. I have no reason to I have no reason to fear I have, I have no reason to fear The Lord is my life The Lord is my life The Lord is my life Oh, I have no reason to I have no reason to fear Oh, I have no reason to fear The Lord is my life The Lord is my life The Lord is my life Oh we have no reason to fear. We have no reason to fear. We have no reason. We have no reason In the year 2024. The Lord is my life. The Lord is our light, yeah. The Lord is my light. Oh. Who has the holy say? Yeah. The Lord has the holy say. We say, who has the holy say? Say, who has the Holy Spirit? Come on, Jehovah, turn our lights around. He turns the lights around. He makes a way. He makes a way where there is no way. Jehovah has the Holy Spirit. Jehovah, turn the 
eternal life around them. Eternal life around. He makes a way. Jehovah turned my life around. He has turned our lives around for the year 2024. He makes a way when there is no way. Jehovah the only say. Jehovah turns our life around. Everybody say. He turns my life around. He makes a way when there is no way. Yeah. Jehovah Are you ready? the only are you ready? 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 Look at your neighbor. Ask your neighbor. Ask your neighbor. Are you ready? 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 Are Because he turned it. We say. Because, because, because he Jesus is standing for us say. He, he is standing, standing, standing He is standing, standing, standing He is standing, standing, standing He is standing He is standing He is standing, standing He is standing, standing He is standing, standing Jehovah turns our life around. Oh, yeah. He turns our life around. He makes a way. He makes a way. God of us. Oh, oh. Jehovah turns our life around. He turns our life around. He makes a way. Are you ready? That's what he turned it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? He turned it. Jesus is turning the road for us. He turned it. The heaven global. He is turning it. He turned 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 it. Say Jesus is standing for you. He turned it. He turned it. He turned it. Come on, your hands. Do it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? We lift our hands in the sanctuary. We say, We lift our hands to give you the glory. We lift our hands. We lift our hands to give you the praise. And we will praise you for the rest of our day. Oh, yes. We will praise you for the rest of our day. We lift our hands. We lift our hands in the sanctuary. We lift our hands. We lift our hands to give you the glory. We lift our hands. Say Jesus, we give you the praise, Emmanuel. Oh, 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 Praise, we, we will praise you for the rest of our day. We will praise you. We will praise you for the rest 
We will praise. We will praise you for you the rest of our day. Hey. Hey. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful one, oh. we love. Beautiful one, we adore. Beautiful one, my soul must sing. Beautiful one, say. Beautiful one, I love. Beautiful one. Beautiful, beautiful one, my soul must sing. Beautiful one, sing. Beautiful one, I love. We are the beautiful one. Beautiful one, we sing. Beautiful one, my soul must sing. Are you ready? My soul, my soul, my soul, my soul must sing. My soul, my soul. My soul, my soul, my soul, my soul, beautiful, beautiful my soul, my soul, my Jesus, my soul, 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 Are you ready? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Creator of the universe, come on, come on, what, can you, what can you do? What can you do? What can you do, Jesus? Creator of the universe, of the universe. what can you? What can you do? What can you change? What can you change, Jesus? There is nothing I shun. Nothing, nothing. Nothing you can not do. Nothing you can. Nothing you can not change. Nothing. Nothing you can not turn around. You are able. Creator of the universe. Creator of the universe. Whoa. What can you do? What can you do? Whoa. Jesus. Creator of the universe. Creator of the universe. What can you change? What can you change? What can you change? What can you change? Jesus. There is nothing to say. There is nothing. Nothing you cannot do. There is nothing. Nothing you cannot change. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing you cannot turn around. You are able. You are able. Praise the mighty God. Oh. I put my trust in you. You are able. You are able. Jesus. It's a question. Yeah. Oh. Is he able? He's able. Is he able? He's able. Is he able to bless us? Is he able to favor? Is he able? 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 Favor to favor you in the year 2020. Is he able? In January. In February. In March, April, May, in, in June, July, in, in August, September, in, in October, in, in November, in, in December, in is he able? He's able. He's able. 
He's able. Is he able? Is he able? Is he able? Is he able? Are you ready? Come on, your hands, three, two, three, two. There is nothing, say it. Nothing you cannot do. Nothing. Nothing you cannot change. Nothing. Nothing you cannot turn on. You are able. We give you praise, we give you praise forevermore. Hallelujah. In the year 2023, we give you praise, we give you praise forevermore. Hallelujah. We give you praise. If you're thankful for the year 23, we give you praise. Oh, we give you praise. Hallelujah. We give you praise. We give you praise. Hallelujah. For January, February, March, April, say we give you, we give, oh, are you ready? You are bigger than what people say, Jehovah. You are bigger than what people say. Jehovah. You are bigger, 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 mighty, 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 mighty God. Bigger than what people say. You are glorious. You are marvelous, God. Bigger than what people say. You are glorious. You are marvelous, marvelous, God. Bigger than what people say. You are bigger, 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 bigger. You are bigger, 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 You are glorious. You are marvelous, God. You are bigger You are glorious. You are marvelous, God. You are bigger You are glorious. You are marvelous, God. You are glorious. Oh, yeah. You are marvelous, God. Bigger than what people say. You are glorious. You are marvelous, God. You are bigger than what people say. You are glorious. You are marvelous, God. Bigger than what people say. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey. 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 Mighty God, you they give me joy, you they give me praise, oh. Where the mighty God, you they give me joy, you they give us praise, oh. Where the mighty God, you they give me joy, you they give us praise, oh. Where the mighty God, you they give me joy, you they give us praise, oh. Where the mighty God, you they give me joy, you they give us praise, oh. If they give us joy, we they give you praise. When mighty God, give you joy, I give you praise. When mighty God, you they give us joy, you they give you praise. When mighty God, you they give you joy, I give you praise. When mighty God, you they give us joy, I give you praise. 
you the give us joy, you the give you praise. You the give us joy, you the give you praise. You the give us joy, you the give you praise. You the give us joy, you the give you praise. You the give us joy, you the give you praise. Great and mighty God, you the give us joy, you the give you praise. Great and mighty God, you the give us joy, you the give you praise. You the give us joy, we the give you praise. You the bless us, say we the give you praise. You the favor us, we give you praise. You the favor us, we give you praise. You the favor us, we give you praise. Favor us, we give you praise. Yeah, yeah. Give out your hands. Come on. Give out your hands. Come on. Give out your hands. 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 Oh. Yeah. 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 To a fire. A fire. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. For your goodness. We thank you. We thank you. For your blessing. We thank you. We thank you. For your blessing. We thank you. We thank you. For your goodness. We thank you. 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 We thank Turn around, everybody. You are able. Praise the mighty God. I put. I put my trust in you. You are, you are, you. You are able, Jesus. You are able. There is nothing to say. There is nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing you cannot do. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing Give God your praise. 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 Are you ready? Hey, everybody, give God five. It's the Haven way. Are you ready? Oh. Everybody give the four. One, two, three, four. Oh. Are you ready? Yeah. Everybody give the seven. Are you ready? Yeah. Everybody give the three. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. Hey. Everybody keep the five. One, two, three, four, five. One more time. Huh? Five is the number of grace. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. Everybody keep the five. One, two, three, four, five.
When I go to my life, when I go to my right, when I go to my life, come on, when I go to my right, when I go to my left, when I go to my right, when I go to my left, when I go to my right, when I go to my left, he's by my side, he's by my side, he's by my shot, when I go forward, when I move forward, when I move forward. When I move forward, hey. When I go by my side, by my side, by my side, one more time. When I go to my left, when I go to my right, when I go to my left, when I go to my right, it's by my side, it's by my side, it's by my side, it's by my side. Oh, hallelujah, I shall believe in God. Hallelujah, we serve a very big God here. Oh, hallelujah, we serve a very big God. Oh, hallelujah, we serve a very big God here. Oh, hallelujah, we serve a very big God. When I go to the left, when I go to the right, when I go to the left, when I go to the right, he's by our side. He's by our side at the haven. He's by our side at the haven. He's by our side at JEM. He's by our side. 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 Oh, hallelujah. We serve a very big God here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give her the dancer. Give her the dancer. Give her the dance. 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 Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 Yeah 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 Come on, are you ready? Just one. A fire. A fire. A fire. A fire. We love you. 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 We love Home in my home, 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 Are you ready? He's a good God. He's a mighty God. Good God. Mighty God. Faithful God. Faithful God. A strength of days. He's my shepherd. I come Elohim. He's the Hell Shaddai. He's the faithful God. He's the awesome God. He never puts you to shame. He's the Omeima, 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 Home in my 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 the God of our boss who John in my hey home in my 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 everybody say home in my home in my home in my home 
Hey, he's a good God, mighty God, ancient of days, mighty God, good God, mighty God, mighty God, mighty God, mighty God, oh, my mother, oh, oh, my mother, oh, oh, my Come on, give God your hands, teach it. Come on, teach it. Come on, teach it. Teach it. Are you ready? Oh my Chala. Are you dancing? Oh yeah. Are you dancing or what? 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 Are you praising or what? Praise it. Praise it. Praise it. Are you praising or what? 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 Hey, oh my Come on. Oh my Come on. Oh they good, they good. Oh my Come on. Oh they good, they good. He's the good God. Happy Nisa. Ancient of days, King of kings, Lord of lords, 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 Lord of lords. There is nothing safe.
We magnify your name, oh God. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Please, size and man, if you can please turn your Bible quickly with me to the book of Psalm 68. Amen. Amen. Psalm 68. We're reading from verse 19 to 27. Psalm 68, verse 19 to 27. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Blessed be the Lord who daily loaded us with benefits. Amen. Even the God of our salvation, Selah. Verse 20 reads, He that is our God is the God of salvation. And unto God the Lord belong the issues from death. Amen. Amen. Verse 21 says, But God shall wound the head of his enemies. Amen. And the hairy scalp of such as one as goeth on still in his trespasses. Amen. Verse 22. The Lord said, I will bring again from Bashan. I will bring my people again from the depths of the sea. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Verse 23. That thy foot may be dipped in the blood of thy enemies and the tongue of thy dogs in the same. Amen. They have seen thy goings, O God, and even the goings of my God and my king in the sanctuary. And the singers went before, and the players on instrument followed after. Among them were the damsels playing with timbrels. Verse 26 says, Bless ye God in the congregation, even the Lord from the fountain of Israel. Verse 27. Verse 27 reads, there is little Benjamin with their ruler and the princes of Judah and their council, the princes of Zebulun and the princes of Neptali. Bless the reading of the word of God. Amen. Amen. That's our scriptural text for this year, 2023. Amen. Hallelujah. Not for this year, sorry. For this month. <laughs> I'm already running out of the year. For this month, the month of December, we give God praise tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We give praise God the all the glory. Yes, ma'am. Praise the Lord. I just want us to, as a church to give thanks to the Lord tonight. Yes, Amen. Ma'am. Amen. For every month this year, the month of January, right through to the month of December. Amen. Amen. January, as we know, was the month of the great light, which ushered us into this new year, 2023. Amen. Amen. We want not to give thanks God, to give thanks to God Almighty for the month of January and all that God did for us as a church, as a body of Christ. In the month of January, we want to appreciate him for all that he has done and all that he continues to do. Amen. Amen. So I want you to lift your voice to the heavens tonight and just say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, oh Lord, oh Lord, we come together tonight. We come together tonight to appreciate you, Lord. To appreciate you, to Lord. give thanks, oh God, to give thanks, oh for Lord. the month of January. For the month of January, the month that you prophesied, the month that you prophesied, the, word, the month that you gave us the word, the month that you gave us that the this word. is our month, that this is our month, or was our month, or was our month, the month of the great light, the month of the great light. Father, we thank you, Father, we thank for you for all that you achieved, for all that you achieved in that month, oh God, in that month. Thank you, everlasting Father. Thank you, everlasting Open Father. Open up your mouth and pray tonight. Thank you for the month of January. For what you did for us in the month of January, Lord. The great light month. The month of January, we thank you, Lord. For all that you did for us as a church. Oh, Lord, we give you praise. For the word that you brought to us. In this month, oh God. The month of January. The month of the great light. What we encountered. What we appreciate, what we did, oh God, throughout that month, we praise you. Thank you, everlasting God. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. February was our month of abundance and overflow turnaround. Amen. Amen. The month of abundance of joy and overflow turnaround. And our scriptural text for the month of February was taken from the book of Psalms 118, verse 19 to 29. Amen. Amen. I want us to thank God for all that he did in that month as well. We know that we enjoyed an abundance of joy in this house throughout the month of February. Amen. I want us to lift up our voice and just thank the Lord tonight. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. For what you did. For what you did. Concerning the Haven Global Church. Concerning the Haven Global Concerning Church. Concerning John Ministry. Concerning Johnny ministry for the month of February, for the month of February, the month that we heard, the month that we heard and encountered, and encountered an, abundance of joy an abundance of joy throughout that month, oh throughout God, that month oh of, God, of February, February, 
in the name of Jesus. Open up your mouth and appreciate God tonight. Give him praise tonight for the month of February, the month of abundance of joy, the month that we encounter, the abundance of joy in this house, the month that was bestowed upon us through grace, the abundance of joy in the heaven global church, in John Enuma Ministries. Father, we say thank you. Thank you, everlasting God. Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. The month of March was our month of victory. And I believe we encountered victory throughout the month of March. And the scriptural text for the month of March was taken from the book of Romans 8, verse 24 to 39. Mm. Romans 8, 30, verse 24 to 39. Yes, I want us to thank the Lord tonight for all that we encountered in this house throughout the month of March. Amen. There is nothing that couldn't have happened. But the Lord stood and said, this is your month of victory. And in this house, we believed that word. We yes. moved with that word. Doesn't Amen. mean that there were no trials or tribulations. But we came out victorious. Yes, so we need to appreciate God for all that he did for us in the month of March. Yes. Open up your mouth, church, and say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. We thank you. We thank you. For the month of March. For the month of March. For all that you did, oh God. For all that you did, oh God. And all that we have encountered. And all that we have encountered. Throughout. Throughout. In this house. In this house. In this commission. In this commission. In the heaven. In the heaven. Father, we say thank you. Father, we say thank Open you. up your mouth and pray tonight. Thank you for the month of victory. The month of March. That we enjoyed victory in this house. As the body of Christ. As a church. As a commission. We enjoyed your victory. Father, we say thank you tonight. Thank you for all that you did in the month of March. We give God all the glory tonight. Thank you for all that you have done for us, oh God. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. April was our month of all round approval. Amen. Amen. All round approval. Taken from the book of First Chronicles 4, verse 9 to 10. We encountered approval even in this house. Right. There were testimonies of contracts being approved. Yes. There were testimonies of, of situations that seemed to be going nowhere, releasing and receiving victory throughout the month of April. Yes. I want you to open up your mouth as a church tonight and say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Oh Lord. Oh, Lord. We come together tonight. We come together tonight. What a better way, Lord. What a better way. To Lord. appreciate you. To appreciate for you. For all that you did for, for us. All that you did for us. As a church. As a church. The Heaven Global, the heaven global church. church. We say thank you. We say thank for you. For the month of April. For the month of April. Our approval month. Our approval month. Father, we say thank you. Father, we say thank Open you. Open up your mouth and appreciate God tonight. Thank him for what you encountered in the month of April. God. You know what you went through. You know what God did for you. Open up your mouth and appreciate him tonight. Give him praise tonight. Thank him for what he encountered this night, oh God. Thank you, everlasting God. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. May was our month of overflowing grace. Amen. Amen. And that was taken from the book of First Peter chapter 5, verse 10 to 11. Amen. Amen. Our month of overflowing grace. And we needed that grace in the month oh, of May. Yes. Those that are here and know, they know that we testify of God's grace in this house Smart. throughout the month of May. His word has never returned back to him void. Smart. There is nothing he says concerning the heaven global church that doesn't manifest. That's right. And as a body of Christ, we believe in his word. Yes. And we enjoy that grace throughout the month of May. Amen. I want you to join me in faith tonight in appreciation for the month of May. Amen. Open up your mouth and say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. We come together in one accord. We come together in one accord. To say thank you, Abba Father. To say thank you, Abba Father. For the month of May. For the month of May. For the sufficient grace that was released. For the sufficient grace that the was released. The overflowing grace that was released. The overflowing grace over that was released. This commission, over this commission. Over the heaven global church. Over the heaven global church. Throughout Lord. the month of May. Throughout the month of Father, May. Father, we say thank you. Father, we say thank Open you. Open up your mouth and pray Father, tonight. In the name of Jesus, pray tonight. Father, we say thank you.
for the overflowing grace that we enjoy throughout the month of May. Father, we say thank you tonight for what you have done and what you continue to do. Thank you for the overflowing grace that we are still experiencing, that we are still enjoying, that you release in the month of May concerning the heaven global church. Father, we say thank you tonight. Thank you, everlasting God. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. The month of June was our month that we were distinguished. We were set apart. We were taken from a place of being too much to being standing out. I just want to appreciate God tonight for making us to stand out not just as a church, but every member connected, associated, related, committed to the heaven global. They were distinguished and they remain distinguished throughout and going into 2024, you shall remain distinguished. Open up your mouth and appreciate God tonight for that month of June for the word that was released that is your month, my month that we were set apart we were set apart from the crowd we were distinguished in the month of June open up your mouth and appreciate God tonight thank you for his faithfulness thank you for the word that was released the word that was spoken forth through your servant supposed to join anyone thank you oh God for what you did in the month of June for the month that you were distinguished in the name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus July was our month of completion and perfection take it from the book of Genesis 2 verse 1 to 4 I want to thank God for his perfecting of the heaven global church worldwide I want to thank the Lord for what he has done and continue to do join me by faith tonight church and say heavenly father heavenly father heavenly father heavenly father oh lord we come in agreement tonight we come in agreement to tonight. say thank you father to say thank you father for what you did for us for what you did for us perfecting, perfecting and, completing and completing your work your work in the heaven global in the heaven global the heaven global church john enuma ministries worldwide throughout the month of july thank you father thank you father open up your mouth and pray tonight pray in the name of jesus Thank you for the completion and the perfection of your work in the heaven global church throughout this month of July. Thank you, Lord, for what you did for us throughout in the name of Jesus. Our God was our month dimensions of new things oh. and indeed as a church we can testify of the dimensions of new things yes, in our workplaces in our careers in our businesses yes, in our personal life we really did see a new dimension yes, even ministerially there was a shift yes, we want to appreciate God for the month of August yes, the Bible scripture for that month was taken from the book of Isaiah 43 verse 18 to 21 I want you to release your voice to the heavens yes, in appreciation tonight Heavenly Father Father, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, oh Lord, oh Lord, we thank you, we thank you for the month of August, for the, month of August, for the perfecting, for the perfecting of, new of new dimensions, for new things, for new things. Father, Father, we thank you, we thank you for, the release for the release of dimensions of new things of of over new the things. heaven, over the upon heaven. the heaven global church. Upon the Upon each, upon each member associated, connected, related, connected, related affiliated, affiliated with, this with this commission, with the Heaven Global Church. Heaven Global Father, Church. We Father, we say thank you Open tonight. Open up your mouth and appreciate God in the name of Jesus. Father, we say thank you for the dimensions of new things that we experience throughout the month of August. Throughout the month of August, a dimensions of new things over your people, 
over the head of global church, over to Nenuma Ministry. In the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, September was our step up month, and indeed we stood up. We step up to new levels, new grace, new dimension, new revelation. Yes, I want you to join me tonight uh, and thank God for the month of September Amen. because he said the word uh, that was released over September is that we are going to step out. Yes, you step out by faith uh, to do something that you haven't done before. You step out uh, into a new realm uh, of possibilities. Uh, I want you to open up your mouth tonight and say Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. We thank you, we thank you for, September, for September, for our step up month. Step up we, thank you, we thank you, Lord, for what you did for us for what you did for concerning us. the Heaven Global, concerning the Heaven, the global, heaven global Church. The heaven global Father, church. We Father, we say thank you. Thank you, everlasting God. Thank you, everlasting Open God. up your mouth and pray tonight. You are appreciating God for what He has done for you and I in the month of September. Thank you for the step up model, for the prophetic word that we endured and enjoyed throughout the month of September. Thank you everlasting Father. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Many are looking at me as I'm raising this prayer point. And they wonder why are we thanking God for each month. Mm. Sometimes as human we forget. Smart. We forget what God has done. And how far he has brought you. Right. But by setting you in remembrance tonight. Mm. We are asking you to think back. Through each month. And remember what the Lord has done for you. Yes, and begin to give him glory tonight. Oh, yes. You cannot at acquire if you don't know how to appreciate. Yes, you cannot get more if you don't know how to, to set yourself in remembrance. Yes, I want you to join me in faith tonight as we continue in prayer. Yes, October was the month of eight dimensions of prosperity. Yes, we know how we've cried to the Lord concerning prosperity in this house. The financial blessings yes, that our health prospering in our health, yes. God's prospering in our careers, prospering in our businesses, prospering in our spiritual life, prospering in, in every dimension of our lives. Yes, I want you to open up your mouth tonight and say, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, oh Lord, oh Lord, we come together tonight. We come together tonight to tonight. say thank you for October. Thank you for October. Thank you for the month. Thank you for the month. The head Dimensions, the eight dimensions that we enjoy, that we enjoy of, prosperity of prosperity throughout the month of October. The month of October. Father, we say thank you. Father, we say thank, thank you, everlasting God, thank you, everlasting for God. your word that never failed. For your word that never failed. According to your word in the book of Third John. According to the word in the book of First John. Chapter one, verse one and two. Chapter one, verse one. Wishing and two. our soul prosperous. Wishing that our soul prosperous. As we also prosper. As we also as prosper. As our soul prosper. As our soul prosper. I want you to open up your mouth tonight yes, and say, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, we thank you, we thank you that, we are in health, that we are in health and our soul, and our soul is, prospering. is prospering. We say thank you tonight, we say thank you tonight for, the for the month of October, for the word that was released. That was we, released. Say we say thank you, Father, for what you have done, what you have done and what you continue to do continue in, to the do. Heaven, in the heaven, in the heaven global church. In the name of Jesus, open up your mouth and cry to the Lord tonight. Thank you for the eight dimensions of new things. You wish above all that we may be in health and our soul prosperous. Father, we thank you that we enjoy prosperity throughout the month of October. We thank you, oh God, for the word that has been released. And we are still enjoying in this house, oh God. Thank you for your faithfulness throughout the month of October. In the name of Jesus. November was our novelty month and royalty month. I want you to just appreciate God. We just came out of November. I know that that 
month, it seems like things were tough. That's right. But the word that came forth ahead of time puts us in a place of walking like royalty. That's right. Moving like novelty. That's right. Knowing that God has spoken. Yes. And when the Lord has spoken, nobody can shut it down. That's right. Believing in that word, we came out of November stronger and better. I want you to open up your mouth tonight and say, Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. For the month of November. For the month of November. For the novelty and royalty month. For the novelty and royalty month. For seeing me through, oh God. For seeing me through, oh God. For seeing the heaven global church through, oh God. For keeping us, Almighty Father. For keeping us, Almighty Father. Walking like royalty. Walking like royalty. In the name of Jesus. Open up your mouth and cry to the Lord tonight. Thank you, Father, for the month of novelty and royalty. In the month of November, the month that you called out of us, you saw us walking like royalty, walking up with our head up high, not being defeated by the chaos in the world, not being consumed by all that is happening, moving like we know whom we serve. We know the God that is with us. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. December. We're still in December. It's our month of total victory and all round testimonies. Yes, I know every day has brought about a new testimony. That's right, ma. My presence here tonight is a testimony. Oh, yes. The Lord has kept me stronger. Yes, ma. In the midst of the chaos, in the midst of the pain, yes, ma. in the midst of the tears, I am standing stronger. Amen. This is my testimony tonight. Amen. I want you to lift your voice to the heavens tonight. Yes, in appreciation, not just for the month of December, but the month that we are going into, we've already stepped into, which is the new year. Oh, I don't know who has that understanding. The moment we set five nights of glory, yes, we are already moving in 2024. Amen. I want you to lift up your voice to the heavens tonight yes, and say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, oh Lord, oh Lord, I come tonight, I come tonight, with a heart of gratitude, with a heart of gratitude, I come tonight, I come tonight, to say thank you, Lord, to say thank you, Lord, for my victory, for my victory, in this month, in this month of December, of December, my month of testimony, my month of testimony, all round testimony, all round testimony, the heaven global church the, testimony. The heaven Open up your mouth and appreciate God tonight. Lika yada 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 bosso tororos. Lika yada yada bosso tororos. Father, we say thank you tonight. Thank you for your word concerning the month of December. Thank you for victory, all round victory, all round testimony. Thank you for your word concerning December, Lord. We appreciate you, Lord. We thank you for what you have done, what you are about to do. And what you shall continue to do, Lord. Thank you as a body of Christ. We say thank you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. The ever global church. We say thank you, Lord, for all our testimonies throughout this month of December. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. As you have given thanks tonight, I release grace upon your life. Yes, Lord. Under the servant of God, Apostle John Enuma. Amen. And the oil and the grace of God upon his life. I say tonight, the testimonies that will surpass all testimonies shall be released upon your life tonight and going forward in the name of Jesus. Hey, I don't think you heard me. I don't think you heard me. The testimonies that you've never encountered. That thing that you don't expect. That miracle that you're trusting God for throughout the year 2023 you have not seen. Yes, because of your presence here tonight. Yes, God is about to do something new. Amen. He's about to release that testimony into your hands. Amen. Your faith will make you receive it. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 
thank you, everlasting King of glory. Yes, Lord. We thank you for what you're about to do tonight. Uh, what you have already done, in fact. Yes, Lord. It's not what you're about to do. Because the moment this program was announced, uh, yes, you've already performed. Uh, we are catching up uh, with what you have already released. Uh, yes. We are opened our faith tonight. Uh, we match that that you want us to see and receive. Uh, yes, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, everlasting King of glory. Yes, thank you, Lord, for what you have done. Thank you, we give you all the glory, all the honor, all the adoration. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. See what the Lord has done, say. See what the Lord has done. What we waited for has come to pass. See what the Lord has done. See, 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 see what, what the Lord has done. See what the Lord has done, say. See, see what. The Lord has done say see what the Lord has done see what the Lord has done see what the Lord has done what we wait to see what we wait for has come to pass see what the Lord has done excellent is your Let's clap our hands, let's clap for Jesus. Clap your hands for you people and shout to the Lord with a voice of triumph. Clap your hands, clap your hands, clap your hands, clap your hands, clap your hands wherever you are, physical or virtual. Clap your hands for you people and shout to the Lord with a voice of triumph. Hallelujah. What a mighty God we serve. I'm excited that you are excited and we're excited that we are here. Yes. Hallelujah. Come on, let's celebrate Jesus one more time. Hallelujah. Gracious God, gracious God, gracious God, gracious God, gracious God. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm still going to step aside for us to receive the special ministration from Grace Throne Worship as the choir. But before I do so, I just wanted to acknowledge the presence of um, very important people in our midst. Amen. The Bible says, give honor to whom honor. Is due. I'm going to start with uh, Pastor Brandon and Pastor Prophet Street. Something of peace, Tabernacle. Let's celebrate Jesus for their life. You all know that they are my covenant brothers. Yes, Lord. He's my covenant brother. You know, we have a tough dynamic relationship. I call him his brother. I call him uh, partner in faith, not partner in crime. <laughs> partner in faith. Uh, like son, but yet still brother, friend, a very good confidant. Um, um, just please, can you come say quick hello to the church? Is it okay? But Prophet Street, what are you doing? Come say hello to the church now. Oh, yes. Amen. Excellent is your name. Excellent is your power. Excellent. Is your power. You are good, you are kind, you are great. Sir. Lord, you are Just 
hello to the church quick. Praise the Lord. Hello, Hallelujah. people of God. Hallelujah. Wonderful, wonderful to see you all again and be back in the house of God at the Amen. Haven Global Ministries. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. I hope you are excited. I hope you are expecting. Amen. Amen. Uh, we've been following online the last few nights. Amen. We know God is doing a lot. Amen. And God is going to do a lot more. Amen. Amen. To the glory of God in Jesus' name. Yes, Amen. Lord. Praise the Lord. Bless you, wonderful brothers and sisters in Christ. Amen. Amen. Prophet, this is what you want to say. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Amen. It's always a pleasure to be in the house. I'm excited, amen, amen, amen. We've been expecting and we've come with an expected spirit, amen. Because we know when God shows up in the Haven Global, He shows up, amen. amen. So we're here to receive uh, from the Spirit of the Living God in the house today. Uh, so I'm encouraging you to dig deeper uh, and Lord. lift up your expectation, amen, to the amen. King of Kings uh, and to the Lord of Lords, amen. Praise amen. God, hallelujah. I'm excited to see some faces I'm glimpsing that I used to see on screen, but I've seen you all here. Uh, and I have special welcome to you in the house amen Hallelujah. we give god thanks for taking you and for having you in our in our presence in our midst that we can celebrate and lift up god together amen we're practicing for heaven and we give god praise thank you come on let's celebrate jesus Hallelujah. amen I know he wasn't expecting it, and I was anti expecting it. Now, I want to also um, welcome, um, just to come say hello to the church. Now, um, the way it's going to happen tonight is after the ministration, I mean, the word goes forth. Um, I believe the Lord laid it, like I said last night, that there will be, I believe, a, f a prophetic flow in the house, and as the Lord leads them, they will. I know you weren't expecting it, like that's the trap I set. <laughs> so there will be a prophetic flow where as the Lord leads them, they just. You know, minister, flow with the crowd, and just pray for the people and bless the people. Um, but prior to that um, stage of the program and the gathering tonight, I just want to welcome very, very special people to me as well. Um, you all have met Pastor Kunle Faladun. Um, his big uncle is one of my mentors, one of the men that shaped me up. I mean, very stubborn young man like I am. And, um, you know, I, I really thank God for what he's done. And to the way he said, his wife, his wife was coming. I said, ha, God has endorsed today to be a blessed day. Oh, yeah. Amen. So Sam and Ma, please just do us a big honor of coming to say hello to the church quickly. And let's welcome Pastor and Pastor Mrs. Kunle and Yinka Falodo. You are good, you are kind, you are great. Say. Shout hallelujah. hallelujah! Hallelujah! Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! It is my pleasure, my joy, uh, to be here again this evening. Praise God! Hallelujah! Um, this is my second time here, and, and every time I come here, I feel a sense of pride in my heart. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! I'm so grateful to God for what He's doing in your midst. Uh, this church is His testimony. Me and John, we know. <laughs> We know this is a testimony. I was talking about him earlier today. I thank God for his life. I thank God for his wife's life. Hallelujah. I thank God for how God has used them so much. And I believe, and I was thinking about it just as I sat down there, I believe that eyes have not yet seen. I believe this truly in my heart, that ears have not heard at all. Amen. It has not come to the minds of men what God is going to do through this man of God. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You are all part of something special Sir. in the name of Jesus. And I believe yes. these five days of glory. I mean, he told me about this a few weeks ago, and I've been thinking about it. And I decided that, you know, we're going to make it today. Amen. Hallelujah. You see, the last three days of the year, my wife knows, are very important to me. I don't do much. It's fine when I wait on God and plan for the new year. But I wanted to be here. So I believe that God has something in store for somebody. Amen. So be expectant. And walk in divine authority. Amen. Don't let voice going to be a special year in your life. Amen. It's going to be a year you will never forget. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever it has not worked in your life up to until now, Stop. forget about it. Amen. God said, Behold, I will do a new thing. Stop. Will you not know it? Right. He said, I will make rivers for you in the deserts. Mm. I will make a way for you in the wilderness. Stop. So forget about last year. This year is already gone. Oh, yes. Start looking forward to the new year. Amen. God, from the beginning, 
It's going to be excellent. Amen. It's going to be glorious. Amen. It's going to be wonderful. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Let somebody shout hallelujah. 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 Thank you everyone for such a warm welcome. I know I'm home. That's all I've got to say. I'm really happy to be here today. I'm very expectant about what God is going to do. Amen. Thank you, Apostle. Thank you, Mama. Thank you for having us here today. Oh, thank, thank you, you everyone. Yeah. Amen. Come on, let's celebrate Jesus. Let's celebrate Jesus. Come on, come on, come on. Amen. Amen. You move mountains, say, with your power. There is nothing, nothing, nothing say Now we're standing here You move mountains With your power There is nothing say Say, you with your power, you perform miracles. Nothing, 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 say, say. It's impossible. I was standing here only because you made. Last night, I did say to us that, um, Revelation is your access point to elevation. Yes, sir. A man that stands out in time is a man loaded with revelation. Mm. Now, there's information you get from man, but there's what you get from God. Yes, sir. What you get from man can be limited to men, but That's what you right. get from God breaks the limitations of men. Mm. So, ladies and gentlemen, listen. Before we receive the ministration of the choir, I want us to take one prayer point tonight. Father, I want to walk out of here with that one word that shapes up my world for the year 2024. Amen. Bible says in Hebrews 11, 1, we know that it says, now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Verse 2 says, now it says, for by it, the elders obtained a good report. Now in verse 3, it says, now we understand that the worlds were framed by the word of God. Father, that revelation that will shape up and frame up my 2024. Lord. Let that revelation locate me tonight. Amen. So lift up your voice. Repeat after me. Someone say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. The revelation, the revelation of, the of, God, of the Word of God. From the Word of God. From the Word of God. In the Word of God. In the Word of God. Through the Word of God. Through the Word of God. The word of God that shall frame up my 2024. That shall frame my 2024. Let that revelation. Let that revelation. Hit me tonight. Me tonight. Hit me tonight. Hit me Let tonight. it locate me, locate me tonight. Let it rest on me tonight. Let it rest on me tonight. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice, open your mouth, and begin to pray for the next 20 seconds. Begin to pray. The revelation that impacts that impact. Impact and impact. Impact and impact. Let the revelation locate me. Let the rest of me, oh God. Let it rest on me. 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 The revelation that impacts and imparts. Let it rest on me. In the name of Jesus. As you declared it, so shall it be. In Jesus' most precious name. Amen. Amen. Please let's be seated as we receive the administration of GTW, Grace Throne Worshippers. And please, if you, if you want to jump to dance as the song ministers to you, please feel free. There's no protocol in the house of God. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The Grace Throne worshippers are excited to minister a special ministration unto you. It's called Overflow by Sinatch. And we pray that we'll be blessed in the name of Jesus. Amen.
Let's just lift up our hands and our voice. Just bless him for the next 30 seconds. Just bless him. Give him the fruit of your lips. Lift your voice up and just talk to him. Whenever you want that the sound of my voice, just bless him. I like my day, you know. Let's rise up, we're going to read the world. Hallelujah. <laughs> but this is a Yibo generation. <laughs> Amen. Let's, let's rise up as we read the word of God that we have our say. God bless you. Amen. Let's break our Bibles quickly to the book of Luke chapter 19. I'm reading from verse 11. Luke 19, 11. Everyone on TV and every, all that platforms are connected tonight. Welcome to Amen. our third night of our five nights of glory. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Luke chapter 19 I'm reading from verse 11 King James Version of the Bible it says and as they heard these things he added and spoke a parable because it was near to Jerusalem and because they had thought that the kingdom of God should come immediately should the kingdom of God should immediately appear. Verse 12. It said, therefore, a certain noble man went into a far country to receive for himself a kingdom. And to what? And to return. Let's read verse 13 together. And he called his ten servants. Do we have it up? God bless you, media. And he called his what? His ten, ten servants, servants and delivered them what? Ten pounds. Ten pounds and said, Unto them, occupy, occupy, till I come, till I come. But his servants hated him, and sent a message after him, saying, "We will not have this man to reign over us." And it came to pass that when he was returned, having received the kingdom, please underline that part that says, "Having received the kingdom," in verse thirteen of Luke nineteen. And it came to pass that when he had when he was returned, having received the kingdom, then he commanded these servants to be called unto him, to whom he had given the money, that he might know how much every man had gained by trading. Please underline the word gained by trading. So that's the second thing. As long as your Bible is not borrowed. Verse 16. Then came the first saying, Lord, thy pound hath gained ten pounds. And he said unto him, Well, thou good servant, because thou hast been faithful in a very little thing. Have thou authority over ten what? Cities. Underline the word, have thou authority over what? Ten cities. Ten cities. Verse 18. And the second came saying, Lord, the what? Thy pound hath gained five pounds. Thy pound has gained five pounds. Sir. And verse 19, and he said likewise to him, Be thou also, meaning have authority also, what over five, five cities. cities. Verse 20, and came saying, and another came saying, Lord, behold, here is thy pound which I have kept laid up in a napkin. Someone say, God forbid. God forbid. 21, it says, For I feared thee, because thou art an astute man. Thou takest up that thou laidest not down, and reapest thou, reapest that thou did not what? So. 22, and he said unto him, Out of thy mouth will I judge thee, thou wicked servant. Thou knowest that I was an astute man, Taken up that I laid not down and repent that I did that I did not so. Verse 22, verse 23. Wherefore then givest not thou my money into the bank, that at my coming I might have required my own with what? Usury. Yes. Father, we thank for the reading of the word of God. Let's what reveal Jesus to us. 
and let this word, oh God, birth a new dimension of revelation in our lives. Amen. Build our, int our intimacy with you. But Lord. most importantly, we'll walk in divine authority in 2024. Lord. In Jesus' name, I will say amen. Amen. In Jesus' name, I will say amen. amen. Please, before you sit down, I want you please to shake the hands of 12 people and tell them, if you say brother, say brother, please don't call men sisters. We are not dead them. We are not ears and ass. We are male and female. Hallelujah. We're not all those LGBTQ minuses. Uh -huh. We're not them. So if you see a man, shake his hand, say brother. If you say ladies, shake hands, say sister, says, Occupy. Occupy. Till I come. Till I come. So shake the hands of 12 people. Tell them, Occupy. Occupy. Till I come. Till I come. Occupy. Till I come. We are walking. Wherever you are virtually, you are walking in abundance. I. We are walking, 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 say, moving, moving. We are. It's a new level, a new season, a new year, dimension of power taking over, over and 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 over. We are walking in a We are Hallelujah. Please let's be seated in the presence of God as kings and as queens and them that know that we have a father. Ladies and gentlemen, I bring you a message titled Occupy Till I Come. Occupy till I come. The Bible says in Luke chapter 19 from... I'm, I'm going to say something. <laughs> Holy Spirit, help me. It's very weird preaching in front of me. <laughs> Pastor Kule, amen. Let me just preach. I remember, let me share a testimony. He, he doesn't know. You know, sometimes in our Christian walk and our faith walk in God, we don't know that there is a certain type of lifestyle you live that before you even say Jesus, you're already preaching. I remember in those days when I used to work in the office, I'll see Pastor Kule. He will be on fasting almost two, three times a week, like a, like a lifestyle. And even as he's working, you can tell he's praying. So, so it's something that rubbed off. You know, um, but we'll give God all the praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Bible says in Luke chapter 19 from verse 11 it tells us about a nobleman. Yes, His nobility carried authority because he was not just a leader but a ruler. Mm. But from understanding it was a ruler that had power. I will tell you what I mean by a ruler and had power. The Bible says now in verse 11 and verse 12 this man embarked on a journey to go take another kingdom. If you look at Luke chapter 19 verse 12, it says it said therefore a certain, this is Jesus, it says a certain nobleman went into a far country to receive for himself a kingdom and to return. He didn't go receive a car. He didn't go receive material things. Listen to me, the standard of the kingdom has been, so, has been now so belittled in our dispensation that we think that owning a car is the peak of God's glory. We have belittled God to a place where we think that buying Rolex is the standard of anointing. 
When Jesus told us in Matthew 6, 33, he says, Seek ye first heaven, the kingdom of God, and his righteousness. The word kingdom means the domain of the king, where the king rests. Yes, the heaven is his throne, the earth is full stool. Mm -hmm. So seek first that place where God has made his balance. That's right. And everything that others chase, we chase. So meaning the things that have now been glorified should chase us. Now the Bible says this man went out to, to receive a kingdom, not to a car, a whole kingdom. So he was a man of power. Now let me tell you something about this man. I do not believe that this man was necessarily liked because he was not liked. But one thing is that despite not being liked, he was not challenged. Are you please listening? Yes, sir. Let me break it down. Luke chapter 19. Look at verse 12. A certain nobleman went into a far country to receive for himself a kingdom and to return. Mm. Verse 13. And he called his ten servants and delivered them ten pounds and said unto them, Occupy till I come. Meaning he gave them power to rule. Mm. But look at what followed in Luke 19, 14. The Bible says now, and it came to, it says, but the citizens hated who? Not the ten servants. They hated him already. Mm. But despite the hate, they couldn't still challenge him. Yes, sir. You can hate me, but as long as you don't have the power to stop me, that's what matters. Yes, so they hated him and sent a message. But did that give them power to take over his kingdom? Yes, no. Sir. It's an error when it's. Let, 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 me, let me take that back. It's not an error to be hated. Jesus said, As they hated me, they will hate you. Mm. As they did not like me, they will not like you. Yes, he said, Greater things with you too. Greater things is not just in miracles, signs, and wonders, in, it's also in my sufferings and in my afflictions, mm. in my persecutions. Greater things you will experience. Yes, Worse things. They hated this man, but despite the hate, the Bible says they couldn't take his kingdom. Mm. He put ten men in charge and then left something with some of them. Which is what I'm going to touch on now. Because one thing that is very important here is the show of power. He said, occupy. Meaning, the charge to occupy till it comes is the power that was bestowed upon them to rule over his kingdom before he returned. Sir. So this man went forth to possess another dominion, another domain, and rule there as well, and then later came back. But one thing I want us to take from this is that the Bible likens this man to the kingdom of God. Jesus' parables was to paint a picture of what we should be. So this man is likened to the kingdom of God. And what is the kingdom of God? The kingdom of God is not in the sky. Many of you think you are looking at the sky every day. Keep waiting. The Bible says now for the kingdom of God is within you. Wherever I show up, I am the king's domain. Am I communicating here? The kingdom of God is me appearing in a place. So when I'm somewhere, it means that God is there. I'm just the vessel. Now, you know, the Bible talks about the Ark of Covenant in the Old Testament. That wherever the Ark of Covenant was carried, the presence of God was there. But in the dispensation of grace, because he is now within us, I am God's Ark of Covenant to my generation. And this dispensation, that wherever I show up, the presence of God is there. So if Jesus liking this man to the kingdom of God, it means that Jesus is saying that until he returns, we also should occupy. The parable was not about the servants alone, but it's about you and I now. It's error to be dominated, but it's absolute and divine to dominate. Genesis 1, 28. It says, have dominion but you cannot dom you cannot dominate or have dominion without power what is power power is your ability to influence and change the course of a situation a man of power is a man that wields so much audacity and authority that when things are flowing contrary he, he speaks a word or he moves something and the whole situation change in the way and to the way he wants it to be so what am i trying to tell us tonight your ability to occupy in 2024 requires power. But what type of power 
do you want? There is power that man can give, but man's power is limited to the power. The power that man can give is limited to the man that gave the power. Are, are, you, are you listening? When I was in Jamaica, I shared something with them. I said, if the prime minister of Jamaica sends out a man as the Jamaican ambassador to the USA, if he's now sent out to live in New York, open an embassy, the man is a man of authority and power. But do you know, if Joe bind him, uh -huh, you understand? We are binding him. So if Joe bind him, decides to revoke the stay of the prime of the ambassador of Jamaica to the USA within the United States, the ambassador has no choice than to but to pack his things and leave. Because power above the power of the prime minister of Jamaica have spoken. Yes, sir. But listen, there is a power above all powers. Yes, sir. The Bible says now the kingdom of God is not in words but in power. Yes. There is a power that when that power stamps on you to operate at a level and a dimension whether they hate you they can't do anything about it yes, they either respond or they bow so I want to prophesy to 10 people tonight yes, that in 2024 yes, from January all the way to December yes, I decree that your environment will bow to you yes, I prophesy that business industry will bow to you yes, where people are dominated you will dominate yes, there is a power that's absolute that's coming upon you. I pray for you. As long as you are under the sound of my voice, you will dominate. You shall dominate. You will dominate. You will not be grammar but power. You will not be grammar but power. You will not be grammar but power. If you believe in raise one side, receive it. If you believe raise one side, receive it. I want you to jump, say yes, 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 I receive it. In the name of Jesus. Please be seated. Two types of power was in motion. The man said, occupy till I return. The man's power was absolute. The people he put there, they didn't like them. If you go back now to our scripture, the scriptural text for the year 2024. Remember that the Lord has said the year 2024 is our year of what? Open doors. And I said to us on the first night, because the door is open, doesn't mean you can pass. Let me tell you, at that door, we have our security personnel, right? Yes, the security department. The door is open to the public. But if they feel like your intention to come in is to obstruct the flow of our gathering, they will tell you, you will not pass. But the door is open. So because the door is open, doesn't mean you have passage. There must be an audacity and authority on you that when you walk through the door, when you show up, even if there's an obstacle, you know, it, no matter what, you know, these are my security men, no matter how big they are, you know some boxers, if they choose to knock them out, they can still knock them out. It's power. Because the door is open doesn't mean you can walk through it. That's why the Lord said, put a program together where we understand that we need to walk in divine authority through open door, the open door that has been said before us. Apostle Paul was talking about the Macedonian cry where he had the revelation of a man crying. He said, Apostle, please come now to us. But yet it took him a while to arrive because there was an adversary in the way. But the Bible says in Psalm 24, it says, lift up your head. So you get, be lifted up your everlasting doors that the king of glory may come in. Even in the realms of the spirit, there are passages that angels require I heard that to pass through. One ask Daniel. The Bible says Daniel prayed and he fasted. As, he, as soon as he prayed, he inquired of the Lord. The first hour, the first minute, the moment he went on his knees, on his knees, God sent a ministry spirit. But in the realms of the spirit, the prince of Persia blocked him. Yes, the door was open, but the angel could not pass. The prince of Persia arrested. This is an angel of God arrested by a demon. Listen to me, child of God. Do not be perplexed when it comes to taking that which
which God has designed for you. The Bible says now, from the days of John the Baptist up until now, the kingdom of God suffered violence, but only the violent take it by force. I want to pray that the audacity, the authority, the rugidity to burst into your open door, that anointing comes upon you. That anointing comes upon you. That anointing comes upon you. You will take the gates of the Gentiles. You will possess your possessions. God's plan for you shall be revealed. It will not only be revealed, but it becomes your reality. If you believe someone shall receive it, and I have it. In the name of Jesus. Please be seated. Revelation chapter 3. Did the Bible said, I have set before thee an open door and no man can shut it. Meaning everything that will happen in 2024 has happened. When mama was praying, she raised a prayer point. She said something I don't think people heard, but I heard it clear. What God, has, God said, he gave us a word, said, Walk in divine authority. Everything that will work, that will need to work in divine authority has been presented. Yes, sir. But translation from a spoken word into your own human uh, in, translation from the spoken word of God into your own human reality is when people miss what God wants to do. Lord bless me. God is saying, but I have done it now. Peter said to Jesus, he says, bid me come. Jesus said, come. Before you get to a place of raising a prayer request, God already knows. Looking unto Jesus, the author and the finisher. The word author means a writer. Your life is a book. The very comma, the apostrophe, the question marks, the paragraph, the chapters of your life. God wrote it. He knows the hand cover, the back page. He has been there. He signed it off. So there is nothing we are going to ask God for 2024 or about 2024 that he hasn't already granted. But the question now is, how ready are we to walk into the realization of God's intention for your existence in 2024? Look at the neighbor, say neighbor. Neighbor. Don't just exist in 2024. If your neighbor is not talking, what do you do? Kiss your teeth. Find another neighbor, say neighbor. Neighbor. Don't just exist. In 2024, it's time to start living. It's time to start living. It's time to come alive. You will not exist only in 2024, but you shall be alive. You will be alive in the name of Jesus. He says, I have set before thee an open door, and no man can shut it. The door is open. The door is open. It's open. But I asked us a question on Wednesday. Are you ready, sir, to walk through it? Mm. Do you have the power to walk through it? Mm. Do you have the audacity to walk through it? Come now, pass. Pass. Go and take it. But listen, God is empowering someone's feet. Yes, Lord. You will move with supernatural speed. Before the enemy sets a trap, you would have escaped. The Bible says, now we have escaped the snare of the fall. I prophesy. Every snare that has been put together by the enemy. Between January to December 2024. Before they cast their net, you would have flown past. In the name of Jesus. Please be seated. I said that power is capacity. Ability as well to change the course of a thing. But how then do we get this power? I've said to us that Jesus of Nazareth is not the man I prayed to. I've said that to us. I didn't preach it. I had to break it down. Oh, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, keep quiet. Don't pray. That's a prayer of lack of revelation. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. But Apostle, in my in act of Apostle chapter 3, oh, there was a man at the gates and Peter said the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. No. Nazareth is a picture that nothing good can come out of something. But if Jesus could come out of that thing, it means that Peter was saying, even in your ugly state, something beautiful is coming out. Yes, sir. It's a revelation. Yes, 
That's why. Every time an angel or even the father talked about Jesus, he said, Jesus says the Christ, the Son, the living God. Ladies and gentlemen, I want us to understand the importance of what's ahead of us. Yes, sir. Power. How do we get that power? Mm. It's understanding the use of the name of the Lord. Yes, sir. Understanding the use. Because you know the name of Jesus and you can't call that name or you don't call that name. Mm. The name cannot work. You must call. There must be a caller and a what? What do we, what's that? Call and um, call and respond. If you don't call, there's no response. A closed mouth will produce a trapped life. You keep it mm, your life to be mm. Mm. pray now. Mm. Apostle, your life eh? mm. and good for you now. Me, I'll be smiling and moving my own. I'll come and spare my 2024. before I respond before every move sound must precede it but the type of sound you raise or that is raised determine the, 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 the kind of flow that responds Acts 2.21 whosoever shall call you know I said this thing last week listen to me if a Muslim calls the name of Jesus with understanding Jesus must respond his Bible he, said, he didn't say any Christian even thank God the Bible didn't call me a Christian because I'm not one I'm a believer any Christian, any Muslim, mm. Buddhist, Hindus, even a Juju man. After all, when something is after them, they always have blood of Jesus. A Juju man. Yes, <laughs> whosoever, the word there is whosoever, whoso. The Bible, or let me say the scripture, is not limited to Christians alone. It's limited to those or let me say it's open to those who have caught the revelation that came by inspiration to men that wrote the scripture. Oh, yes. Whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Yes, sir. Understand the use of the name. Mm. Don't just say I know Jesus. No, call him. Yes, sir. Many call their problem than they call Jesus. Mm. Oh. Many say, oh! In fact, they've said you know, I was praying for someone the other day. Imagine you pray, you are sweating. After praying almost five minutes, the person said, Apostle, you don't understand. This, my problem is too much. I said, you will die with it. Oh. You will die. I, yes, the, the woman was upset. I said, listen, I prayed five minutes. You have no faith to say amen in Jesus' name. The first thing you said after praying is telling me that your problem, and she said, my problem, I said, it will be yours. Huh. You have claimed ownership, it will be yours. And I hung up. Let the weak say, I am strong. Your confession is your possession. Yes, sir. I don't think you heard me. Your confession determines your possession. Yes, the profession of our faith is that Jesus is Lord. And when we call upon that name, this must happen. Can I prophesy here? I pray over your life that in the name of Yeshua Mashiach, the Son of the living, the Almighty, the Most High God, 2024, it will work well for you. Shall work well for you. It shall work well for you. It will work well for your children. Your business will operate well. Your head will function well. If you believe someone said, receive it. And now I have it. Number two, how do we walk? Or how do we get this power? Number two, ask for the Holy Ghost. If you ask for power without the Holy Ghost, it's like putting the cat before the horse. Mm. You cannot have the Holy Ghost and abuse power. Yes, the Holy Ghost keeps you in check on how you use power. Even Jesus of Nazareth. You see, that's why I don't pray to Jesus of Nazareth. Listen to me. Jesus of Nazareth, meaning God incarnated, taking the flesh of man, the form of man, whilst he was here with me, he said, you will do greater things. But now, after he died, resurrected, ascended, exalted, elevated, given a position, the right hand of the Father, and given a name above every other name. Nobody can beat that. Sir. 
So the man of Nazareth, we can beat that one. All his earthly achievements, we are meant to break all. I don't think you heard me. Yes, sir. Imagine me just hold this man, just walk on air right now. Ah, he has slaughtered two goats. He has, he has slaughtered two goats. <laughs> how, many, how many women did he cut their hair to get power? To walk on air. Even Prophet Estrich, I hear we stand up. She, she would just say, oh, honey, let us take our children. Let's be going. <laughs> I told us yesterday that the Bible says, when Jesus told them he would meet them on the other side. He went straight to the mountain. Prayer. After prayer, encounter. Encounter became the envelope on his human body. Sir. That made him walk on water. And when they saw him coming, they shouted, this is a ghost. Fear gripped them. He said, don't fear, it's me. Peter said, okay, if it's really you, beat me to come. Jesus said, come. And he went. He said, come. And he went. chapter 10 verse 38 simple answer how God anointed Jesus who not Jesus Christ Jesus of Nazareth listen the Holy Ghost cannot speak to you without giving without Jesus giving the Holy Ghost information Tells us is what the son tells the comforter to tell us Sir. because everything that Jesus tells the comforter to tell us is what the father has told the son. Mm. How God anointed Jesus of Nazareth, you know, Jesus also advanced, he grew. The 12 year old Jesus was not the 30 year old Jesus, Sir. he grew in wisdom. He grew in status. Because why? There were seasonal glows of power. But most importantly, the Holy Ghost upon him. So he went about doing all manner of good. Healing them that were oppressed of the devil. For God was with him. I want to pray over someone's life. Tonight we catch a new revelation of the Holy Ghost. When you leave this place, everywhere you enter, ay, 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 you will walk in power. Goodness will follow you. Mercy will follow you. Grace will back you. Favor will respond. Light will shine. Power will flow. If you believe someone say, I receive it. It's my portion. I receive it. It's my portion. Please be seated. How God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power. Then now he went about doing all manner of good. He linked them that were oppressed of the devil for God was with him. The absence of God is the absence of manifestation. Number three, to move, to, to get power or how you get power is to ask God for his presence. When you have the presence of God, you become his essence to man. When you have the presence of God, you become his essence to man. There are many who are loaded, but yet discarded. Heavily gifted, but not celebrated. Why? A man's gift can make, is it room for him? Make a way for him. But is the presence, which is the glory of God on that gift, that makes him celebrated at the top and it stays there because the glory doesn't go from glory to, gr to glory to story it goes from glory to glory now it says beholding as in the very image of Jesus we go from what? glory beholding as in a glass the very image of Christ as we go from what? glory to glory there are about five things I want to share with you tonight so that we can receive God's intention in other forms tonight Sir. I said power is your audacity your authority your ability to change the course of events mm. see I want you to take something home tonight you know stop contracting everybody to pray for you mm. on the internet today 
Everybody is a prophet. But when it gets to speaking against LGBTQ minuses, you're afraid. Oh. Hmm? Speaking against sin and unrighteousness, we're afraid. Lord, use me. I am available to be used. That prayer, if you check the heart of the, of the prayer warrior, they're only saying, God, make me famous. famous. God using you doesn't mean that the world should know you. As long as he knows you and what you are doing, that's all that matters to him. The power of God carries some essentials I want to tell us tonight and why we must walk in this power. I did say, I believe it's 1 Corinthians chapter, is it 420? It says, for the kingdom of God is not in words, Pastor Lapia. It's not in American accent. You go to Dallas, Texas. Don't go and be speaking English. You know, you, you know, man, don't mend them. <laughs> eh? The kingdom of God is not in word, but in power. And I've said that the kingdom of God is not some castle in the sky, but you and I. Meaning that John Enuma is not in word, but in power. Power is not what you say. Power is in the move and the show of life. So what are the essentials of power, especially the power of God, and most importantly the power of God, that I want us to know so that we engage this power? Number one, the power of God is the power of revelation. The power of God is the power of revelation. Genesis chapter 1 and chapter 2 tells us and shows us heavily about God's power of revelation. Genesis 1 1. In the beginning, God created past tense, the heavens and the earth. Your 2024 already is in your mind. Yes, sir. Right? The private jet you want to buy, oh. mansion you want to build, yes, sir. castle you want to raise, marriage, wedding day you are trusting God to get to. You see that one that touched her, she shout, Amen. Uh -huh. Amen. <laughs> so shall it be. Amen. I will fly to Barbados for your wedding. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Genesis chapter 1, verse 1. Amen. In the beginning, God created. The key word there is this word. Created. Past tense. Meaning everything God wanted to create was first in his mind. Mm. But it was power that translated it from mind to reality. And how? He said now in verse 3. After the spirit moved. Remember I said no spirit, no power. The spirit is the, is the moderator of power that flows through you. Sir. Genesis 1, 2. And the spirit of the Lord moved. The surveyor. Send the Holy Ghost now into your 2024. Let him survey. So you speak. Mm. After the Holy Ghost has surveyed for you. When you speak, you can't miss him. You can't miss fire. Nobody can challenge your word. The earth was without form and void and Darkness was upon the face of the and the spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. Verse 3. And God said, Let there be light. Simple. What happened? Period. Revelation. The power of God is the power of revelation. God's word was not challenged when he spoke. There was darkness there. He spoke into darkness, light came out. Listen, this 2024 coming, every darkness that is waiting, I speak light into those darkness. Let there be light. Let there be light. Let there be light. Let there be light. In the name of Jesus. Let there be light, period. There's power in you. Number two, essential of power that we must know so we can use power, cry for the power of God through the Holy Ghost, is that power refutes. Power refutes. F, sorry, R E F U T E. It refutes. Second Timothy chapter 3, verse 16. Power refutes. The word of God is a standard. Above all philosophies. 
don't let your philosophical reasoning determine how you address situations in 2024. Sir. They say, ah, logically, I say, that, keep quiet there. Mm. Logically. God is not logical. If you want to be logical and work with God, nothing would work. He says, all scriptures are given by inspiration of God. Yes, sir. And is profitable for doctrines, reproof, correction. The power in God in you, the power of God in you, when you speak, understand is meant to refute. Let it, let it checkmate your philosophy. England, we have too many grammatarians. We think that the greatest standard, the, the greatest achievement is British passport. Take the passport to the bank and I go and collect money. They will arrest you. Enter bank, HSBC. Can I see the manager, please? I want 10,000 pounds. They say, give us your bank card. You know, there are even different grades of bank cards now. There is cash card. Some people, you have cash card and a British passport, you have arrived. Cash card. Even God cannot talk to you anymore. Like British passport is access to paradise. Where someone, I remember some years ago, a man called for prayers. I prayed for him. And God answered his prayers. He had no papers, but he was the one that was the contractor maintaining the biggest shopping mall in Kent. No British passport. His take home was 56,000. In this country. And many are speaking. You know, good morning, mate. How you doing? Me, how are you doing there now? And you have nothing to show for it. Use the word of God sir. to polish your confession in 2024. Mm. You see, power will flow. Yes, sir. Situation will respond. Amen. You redress what has been designed to address you wrongly. Mm. You dress it up the way it should be. Yes, sir. That's why many people call me. I don't like having conversation. I don't want to hear your problem. Let me tell you. Let me introduce, let me introduce my God and the possibility of my God into your problem. Don't tell me, ah, oh, man of God, you know, my side, do the day, the devil do me like this. No, let's straighten it out. Yes, Look at the neighbor, say neighbor. Neighbor. Refute. 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 By shaping up. By shaping up. Your philosophy. Your philosophy. With the word of God. With the word of God. Number three. Sir. Power redirects. Mm. Power redirects. First Peter 2.25. First Peter chapter 2 verse 25. Power redirects every complete life as experienced an incomplete process in the past. Every perfect today experienced an imperfect past. First Peter chapter 2 verse 25. Can I have it up? Thank you. For ye were a sheep going astray. But are now returned unto the shepherd, the bishop of your souls. That was a redirection. If the soul of man can be redirected, how much more of human situations? Mm. Something is going one way. Sir. You say, stop there. In the name of Jesus, I address you, my finances. Now, you won't go downwards. You go what? Upwards. I pray that now, yes, Lord. into your future, I prophesy. Yes, that your 2024 is directed Amen. by the word of God. Amen. Directed by the word of God. Amen. The airspace of your 2024 yes, is directed by the word of God. Amen. The water space of your 2024 yes. directed by the word of God. Amen. The land space of your 2024 yes, directed by the word of God. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The human and mental space of your 2024 yes, I direct it by the word of God. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Number four, power reproduces. Mm, mm. If you cannot produce, you are as good as dead. Yes, sir. The Bible says, be fruitful, multiply, replenish, subdue, and have dominion. The word fruitfulness is not only having children. It means productivity. You can have ten children, but you're not productive. Mm. Twenty children, but not fruitful. When I was to get married, mama and I, we sat down. We said, I said, so, you know, these are the things we asked ourselves. So how many children would you like to have? Mama said, I would like to have six children. I said, six. I was afraid. I said, Lord. I said, I said, six. You know why she wanted six? Because when we were in courtship at the time, 
she, we flew to Nigeria. She came to Nigeria to see my family. So she saw my mother's children, my siblings, and I. We were six. Five boys, one girl. She was right in the middle of the five boys. So any boy that have broken her heart, we used to beat the boy in those days. I've repented. Anyway, back. She said she wanted six. I said, why? I love the sense of a large family. Please ask her to that many children that she wants. She said, as God give, I am fine. <laughs> After experiencing two. <laughs> two. 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 You can have 20 children, but you are seen as unfruitful before God. Yes, sir. The power of God to reproduce means for a man's life to become productive. The man told them, occupy till I come. Watch this. Your inability to reproduce is consequential. Yes, and it will stop you from ruling with authority. A man that reproduces, a man, it's a man that will rule. Mm. This noble man gave servants, he said, ten talents and um, five and um, one. The one with the ten multiplied is to ten. You know the church, we that is where we focus on and we stop there. But if you see what the Bible says, the Bible says the noble man was so happy. It says now, you see those ten you multiply. It says now you will have authority. Yes, sir. The places, if you want to be a man of authority, is in the place you have multiplied, not in the place you think your certificate will give you access to. Mm. School and education is not access to prosperity. That's right. It will moderate you and shape you up to, to understand society, but it's not access to prosperity. Yes, sir. What makes a man prosper is what God has put in your hand. Moses, what is in your hand? Mm. Prosperity comes when you know how to reproduce what God has put in your hand as a seed from the existence of your life. When a child is born, a child is born closed hand. Yes, when I saw my two children after labor, the first thing I noticed, my son had his fist like this when he was born. My daughter had a fist like this when she was born. Whether it is male or female, it's not, the, it's not about the gender, but the agenda, the agenda of God in their hands. When a man dies, a man dies like this. Jesus died, his hand was open. Why? He said, it is finished. Meaning he has given everything that, was, that he came to this world. If he had multiplied it, it's an error to die close fisted. It means you didn't release the seed and the seed did not multiply. 2024, every gift of God in you, you will multiply. Your children will multiply. You will multiply. You shall multiply. You will multiply. The seed of God in your hand will not die. The seed of God in your hand will not die. That business is coming alive. That ministry is coming alive. That gift is receiving a lift. If you believe someone say, multiply. In the name of Jesus. Sit down five minutes, please. A man is born with his fist. Close fisted. Go and see every child that is born. It, yeah, yeah, yeah. The hand is always closed. Meaning, I have come to this world with something. And when a man dies, he dies like this. Meaning, I have given my all. But the question, son, is how many people really give their all? Look chapter 4. Luke chapter 19 verse 16 says it all. Then came the first saying, Lord thy pound had gained 10 pounds. Look at verse 17. He speaks for himself. And he said unto him, well thou good you know when I was growing up Pastors that preach to me, they always say, the man said, well done. If he says, well done, it means it is finished. Because you are promoted to a new level, doesn't mean you are done. The expectation has increased. Oh. Many people just get some promotion. You, you, you are a minister. The day you did first Bible reading in church, your shoulder pad rise. You are not general of Asia. Walking in here like I'm like a, a wrestler in church. No. That, that place where you have been, God has graced you to read your first Bible reading in church is a platform 
to rise to a new dimension of ministry. The ministry of God's calling you through Christ Jesus. He says, well, meaning, okay, it was a surprise. Not well done. Because we've heard gospels, I would say, well done, my good. No, no, if he says well done, it means his work is finished. Yes, 2024 is not a year of well done. Yes, it's a year of expectation from a, of a, from a higher dimension. Yes, sir. If God is giving you authority through open doors, he's expecting something more. He says, and he said unto him, well, you see that? Well, comma, um, English scholars, publisher, publisher, Let's sit down, sit down. Keep sleeping, keep sleeping. Uh, please, read this in British accent for me, please. How it is read, not the, my Nigerian reading. And he said unto him, mm -hmm. Well, thou good servant. Sit down. You don't have to read. Who can read King James Version? Luke 19, verse 17 says, mm -hmm. And he said unto him, Well, thou good servant. No, stop. You don't have to read. Who can read with punctuations? Do we have teachers? See no waters. This is not Jamaica. No, no, me no go, me no go. Me no go, me no go. Sister Pompey. Yeah. Yeah. Girl. And and he said unto him, Yeah. Well. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thou good servant. You see this? And he said unto him, Well. It's like someone coming to say, ah, Apostle, Apostle, Apostle. There is a car parked at the door. Once you see, you say, okay, well, okay. There is a, well, meaning the attention of the nobleman was arrested by the act of multiplication mm. that was done by the first servant's ability to turn 10 to 20. Sir. It says, well, not well done. How I many of you have heard the word well done? Pastors who say it. That is why when someone is preaching to you, open your Bible and read it. Revelation chapter 2 verse 1. Brrr, this man can preach. Oh. Ah, he's a machine gun preacher. Everything he said doesn't match the Bible but matches the Quran. <laughs> and you didn't check. I was serving under a pastor in those days. Every time he preaches, I open Bible. One day I was in his house as we were serving. I was waiting for him so I can take him somewhere during protocol. All my, all my fellow protocols, they were jumping up and down just to, just to lick the man's backside, just looking for human favorism. I was by the dining table. I carried Bible. I was reading. He came, he was coming from his bedroom and he went, it's like the Holy Spirit took him through that same passage where I went to hide to just be reading Bible. He stopped, he looked at me. I didn't even know he saw me. When we went to the program, he started preaching and he told all of us to stand up and he said, all of you are carrying my Bible, but this man wants the Bible in him. I didn't know he spotted. Wow. Protocol is not show. I'm with the man of God. 20 years, nothing is manifest. Well, this is an exclamation. This is a reflection that the nobleman was shocked that that servant could turn 10 to 20. So, well, good servant. May God call you a good servant. Amen. God, may he call you a good servant. Amen. May God find you good Amen. in the service Lord. of his work in the name of Jesus. Amen. He says, well, well, thou good servant. He says, now, because you have been faithful in a very little, like they say in Jamaica, he says, watch this. Have thou authority over ten cities? Watch this. Sir, the man gave, the nobleman gave the first servant a talent. Sorry, ten talents. He turned it to twenty talents. Mm. The blessings that followed for multiplying ten to twenty was that he now had authority over ten cities. Meaning, every talent of God in us is meant to be as big as a city. Mm. Achievement that is less than a city is failure. You will rule over cities. Amen. 
You shall rule over cities. Amen. You will rule over cities. Amen. England will respond to you. Amen. I don't care your age. Yes, you de- they think you are young. Listen, listen, listen. It's not age, it's grace. Oh, yes. I prophesy that the raging power of the grace of God yes, will make you come of age in the presence of important men. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Are we listening? It says now have authority over 10 cities just because of 10 talents. Your ability to reproduce gives you the position of authority. 2024, you will not be barren. I curse every spirit of barrenness out of the church in the name of Jesus. Your children will not be barren in school. Your career will not be barren. Your health will not be barren. Amen. Your mind will not be barren. Amen. Your soul will not be barren. Amen. Your spirit will not be barren. Amen. Your confession shall not be barren. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Let me let me quickly give just two and we we'll pray. Number five. Essential of power that we must very much know so we can engage the power of God through the Holy Ghost is the power to revive. Power to what? Revive. Are things dead in your life? Are things not working in your life? Speak. You know, some things that still puzzles me when I read the Bible is the power to revive. It says, now the same power that raised Jesus from meaning he was revived. When Lazarus died, I'm sure people said Jesus planned it. Mm. Yes. He died. I must have planned it. They gave him sleeping tablets to sleep for four days. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. People sent it. So you know what? He laid his own life down. And power revived him. Yes, sir. The razor the raised. The razor raised. Yes, sir. The razor. And you know, the thing about the power of God to revive, mm. it's not because you are an apostle or you must be anointed or ordained a prophet or a pastor before you can revive situations. Yes, sir. You know, with all humility and joyfully in my heart, I always share the story of late Archbishop Benson in the house of Blessed Memories. That is, in ministry, that is the man himself and Apostle Joseph Ayo Babalola. Those are the two men I study. They are men of mysteries. How can someone fall from story building, hit head, the brain open, the skull burst open, they pull the brain back, he, he prayed, the brain closed. The skull closed. A man went to the mountain to pray. Prayed his knee was so hot it melted stone. My my, my, my younger brother, his name is Paul, Pastor Paul, is a pastor in CAC. Yeah. He was ordained, what was it, it? three, four years ago now? He was ordained. Now, one day we're talking. As we was talking, you know, (laughs) My, he prays like CAC people. We're talking. I say, bros, come down, come down. I say, after you finish this one, you better move in power. If not, go and get food to eat. Drink water and come down. He said, do you understand? 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 I said, you want to say, Apostle Joseph, are you blah, blah, blah. He said, yes. I, want. I said, now, you people are quoting him. When you should be greater than him. Ministry, they put a picture of a man. A man called Daddy Gio, Pastor E.A. Adeboye. I pity a lot of redeemers because their redemption is by their followership of that man, not Jesus. Wow. I was a redeemer. Even Papa said that any place you see them sell my picture, he said, don't buy. If they sell my ribbon, uh, it's in the ribbon, uh, not ribbon. What they call it? 
Eh? Wristband. He said, don't buy it. I am not God. The man is still, to him, he hasn't done enough. But people will say, daddy said, but his daddy is not talking to them. So, the reason why God has not taken him is because if he goes today, everything will scatter. Wow. Nobody yet is fit in the redeem mm. to sit on his chair. Wow. I know what I told God. I don't aspire that chair. Mm. I aspire what that chair would have thanked God for in future. Yes, sir. That's why, sir, that's why I left redeem. They wanted me to open a branch in Kent. I mean, in Northamptonshire. I said, God said no. And many other things. Hmm. Power to revive. 2015. Some of you were in church. I was hearing how people, you know, I heard them, um, that was a story. It, it was, I think it was it Assemblies of God or one of those churches. So, the Assemblies of God, I've forgotten the church now, please forgive me if I'm wrong. The pastor that was preaching said, the power of God is able to do everything. Mm. Papa said, even to raise the dead. The pastor said, well, I have not done it myself. But I believe it's possible. So. Papa said, okay, no problem. Archbishop Benson Dawsa of Blessed Memory went out that same hour on his bicycle of Okada. Till 4 p.m. Found a girl that just died. Fresh bread death. Begged the family, negotiated, and they all came out. He prayed, and the girl was revived from death. Hallelujah. His first miracle is still the pursuit of many after 50 years in ministry. So what is wrong with our generation? Mm. When I heard that story, and then nobody told me about Apostle Babalola. I had a dream. A man walked to me. He said, I want to introduce myself to you. I said, Who are you, sir? He said, My name. He spoke in Yoruba. He said, the Yoruba, eh? you know, this is not this Oibo, Oibo, Yoruba. But for some reason, despite not knowing Yoruba, I understood what he was saying. But he was saying, Orukomini. He didn't even call himself Apostle. He said, My name is Joseph. Ayo, Babalola, go and study me. And I woke up. And I told my wife, who is Babalola? Said, she said, type it now and check. I typed it. He's the CAC man. That was how I knew about him in 2015. Wow. I, you know, after I got those two things about it, Dausa and Babalola, the first thing I went to do is 21 days prayer fasting. Mm. Try. After I tried it once, I don't want it again. 21 days dry. Me, as I am, I'm managing to grow fat. I, I, I vanished. Six days into the fasting, I vanished. The cloth, the cloth was wearing me. I wasn't wearing cloth. All my cloth was like duvet. <laughs> to God be the glory. I started the fast on, a, I think it was a Wednesday. On Sunday, I was so weak. I said, no, I will stay at home. But because the ministry, being so new and young, I dragged myself because I had nobody to preach. I sat down until it was time to minister. I came out of the office, came to the auditorium. As soon as I picked up the mic to preach, I was moving, I leave four days, not even 21 days, the fourth day. You know, the first four or five days is the toughest. Once you can break past those four or five days, you go into, into autopilot. Oh, yes. And thank God. Mama locked the kitchen. I was begging. Please. It's okay. Three days, I'm fine. She said, you want to be Babalola. Fast. <laughs> she locked the kitchen. I said, please, please. She locked the kitchen. Locked door. There's no going outside. There's no going to the kitchen. She locked me in the room. You want to? Babalola. Pray, pray. And you know the funny thing? She started praying with me outside. You can. When I'm getting tired, I'll be hearing, Lord, strengthen him. I said, oh, Lord, I cannot fail. Let me go back. <laughs> the fourth day 
was a Sunday service. As I picked up the mic to preach, a lady entered the church. She picked up her phone during message. I started singing a worship song as I was preaching. My eyes opened. The Lord took me the spirit of the Lord and I entered that phone and I saw a dead child on the phone. I said, Madam, who, who has died? She said, Ah! It's my niece. People think that the way they cry determines how God will move. Cry catches his attention. Faith moves him into action. Yes, so you, it's good to attach both cry of faith. Attention, then action. Mm. I said, stop, stop, stop. Don't glorify death. I said, where is the child? The child has been like vegetable is dead in Northampton General Hospital. I said, so what's the current state? She said, everything is dead. They just kept a thing on his brain. to just keep the brain alive in case they want to do something with the body. I said, okay. What's the child's name? She mentioned it. I said, in the name of Jesus, child, come to life. That was all I said. And I simply went into the sermon. 45 minutes later, as I was preaching, she ran in, boom, her phone was on fire. She said, the moment we prayed, the child jumped from the bed. Wow. And the first thing the child did, a dead child was asking for food. The sermon finished now. You see, that weakness of four, five days fasting, I was ready to go 40. I said, where is, where is the fasting? <laughs> where is the fasting? Up? I got to my say, mama, lock the door. Throw the key away. Let me... <laughs> Listen, the power to revive dead situations. I don't know what power has buried your glory. I don't know what power has buried your light. I don't know what power has buried your children. I don't know what power has buried your business. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God, that business, the glory of your life, the glory of your health, come to life. Come to life. Your business is revived. 2024 is revived. Your blessings are revived. Your testimonial life is revived. Your breakthroughs are revived. In the name of Jesus. I think we should just pray. Let's remain standing. Lord, I'm asking for power. But first, where is the Holy Ghost of God? You know, I like the Holy Spirit. But I don't spend time with the Holy Spirit. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. Ah, but is it not the same? It's one person, two operations. Holy Spirit is introduction. Holy Ghost is operation. One is humble, one is rough. One, one comes to you with a negotiating personality. The other breaks your protocol and invades you. Yes, Jesus came out of water like a dove. Holy Spirit came on him. Acts 1 and 2. Some men were waiting. Boom! Like a mighty rushing wind. The Holy Ghost scattered their meeting. Took over. Invaded. No permission needed. Lord! Where is the Holy Ghost? Yes, so you will pray that prayer. Many of you, if a witch can still enter your house and press you and don't retire from witchcraft you are failed. I heard one pastor preaching. Ah, don't eat in the dream. When you eat in the dream, ah. I mean, it's one thing to go to your dream looking for food. I don't know what's wrong with us. <laughs> but <laughs> one day I was <laughs> let me let me say. So one day I, I, I was hearing this sermon. Ah, repeated, repeated in different preach different ways. You know, there are some gospel that don't liberate your mind but puts you in bondage of fear. Mm. Even though they want to deliver you, it's like you're going further into fear. Yes, sir. So, sir, you know, one thing hits me. Pastor B, I said, I will go to bed. I will make sure I brush my teeth, drink water. So that my mouth is not tasting for food. So, peradventure, the food I ate in dinner is entering my dream. You know, that kind of... I'm telling you, so messages should just make you start living in bondage. We have not received the spirit of God. We have not, not been adopted to fear. Mm. We're not bond men. Sir. We 
only brought men to the gospel. That's right. I, I slept one night. And in that night, for some reason, I just saw me eating fufu. I just woke up. So I, you know, I woke up whilst I was eating the fufu and trying to swallow. So when I woke up, I kept what was supposedly the fufu in my throat. I went to the toilet. We ate Because someone said, so I went to prayer. Lord. The Lord said, do you know Peter? I said, yes. Go and read the Baptist encounter with Colonials. I know they've preached it. But people have mistwist, twisted Bible to put people in, in slavery. That's why Africa will suffer till Jesus returned because of religion. No intimacy in Africa. I'm sorry to say it, but I'm not sorry. That's why they don't like me. I don't like them too. <laughs> Peter! Kill and eat. In the dream. After I had that encounter, when I sleep, if you want to bring fufu to me, I will wear apron, wash hand. We're eating together. When I wake up, I will say, devil, is that all you brought? When I was young, I watched a movie that was created by Pastor Bamidele. Many of you don't know him. Mount Zion Ministry. I'm, 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 I'm right with the names there, Pastor Bamidele. Bamiloye. Thank you, sir. Bamiloye. Very that, the revelation this man has got about the things of the spirit, it marvels me. Mm. Those are the type of men I want to go and sit down and say, sir, just put hand on them. Sir. How many of you have watched Isha Wuru? Ayamatanga? Arometa? Ha. Go and watch movie. Leave, leave, leave Hollywood. Leave Superman. Go and watch witches, people that rip power from hell. You will learn to pray. Nobody will tell you. You're waiting for you're waiting for pastor to say, lift your hands and start praying. When you see some work of darkness, prayer will become your lifestyle. Yes, sir. Watch. I was young. This was in Nigeria. I watched this one of this man's movie. There was a, 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 a pastor that was sent by his church to a village, a very chronically diabolic village, to go preach the gospel. When he got there, they didn't let him into the town. He started preaching, they swore to kill him. So he went, ran into, I think, a deep forest. That was where he could go hide because they were looking for him. He was hungry for days. So he climbed the tree and was hiding on the tree. But for some reason, the, the, the hunters, the killers, the chasers couldn't go close to that area. Why? The tree that he climbed was the God of the village. You see, what is their God? We are gods too. That's why Jesus says, did they not say ye are gods? You are God. You are walking like a dog. They say it's a dog eats dog world. That's why you are still a dog. Huh. Look, it's a lion kill lion world. Sir. Satan a rowing lion. Jesus dead lion. Mm. So it's a lion chop lion world. We eat on lion. We don't eat on dogs. This man, whilst he was on the tree, they couldn't come close. So he was so happy. He didn't even know what tree he climbed. Please, please hear this. The moment he, after this night, yes, we pray. See, see, the moment this man climbed the tree, I was watching this movie. Guess what? The juju. Those of you from the Caribbean islands, what do you call it? Obia. Uh -huh. So the obia. The obia, the juju. The man, the man, this preacher climbed the tree to hide whilst they wanted to kill him. The obia, the juju, the spirit that governs the village was in that tree. Sir. That was a shrine. Mm. The spirit ran out of the tree. Meaning, juju met juju. I am a deity to deities. Yes, sir. I enter a place. I should be greeted mm. by demons. Yes, sir. The man, he, he didn't even know. He just climbed the tree thinking he was hiding. Not knowing that by that act, he had eradicated the powers of the village and God has given him the key to that village. Yes, sir. But he did not even know. He just climbed the tree. You know, sometimes God will allow the enemy to pursue you so that you can find who you are. That's right. He climbed up the tree. 
The juju left the tree. The juju left the tree. He didn't even know what had happened. It was just here saying, ah, Oluwa. It was, it was a Yoruba movie. They were writing it on the, interpreting it on the screen. He was just saying, Lord, help me now. They want to kill me. How can you let, allow them to kill me? But in God's mind, God is saying, but you don't know that you have already killed their devil. Mm. Pastor Philip, sir, you understand what I'm saying to you? Uh -huh. They can pursue, but they don't know you have killed their devil. Guess what? The following night was the night of full moon sacrifice. Sir. So the whole village, they danced. Some brought, and guess what? That particular ritual was meant to come with cooked food only. No raw food. So they brought yam, fish, egg, oil, water, palm wine, everything to their supposed tree juju. But not knowing that there was already a juju on the roof of the tree. That has evicted their own juju. <laughs> so, the man they were chasing to kill, they didn't know they were bringing food to feed him. <laughs> so, once they brought the food to the tree, the man was just there saying, God, see yam, see beans, see rice, see chicken. Father, I thank you. They didn't know. After they had left, after the sacrifice, the man came down and ate like a god. <laughs> after he finished, the Lord said, do you now know where you are? He said, this is their shrine. He said, I made them pursue you. And the only escape route was where they thought you would be dead. Mm. I gave life to this village by making you kill what was meant to kill them. Wow. You have ended the power and the dominion Sir? of their God here. You are now the God to their God. Wow. So go and take the village. Yes, the man entered the Oba's palace. And before the Oba finished talking, he said, call me your strongest man. They came and said, sit down. They tried to do, nothing was working. They said, do you know that your juju, I have ended him. Mm. Through the power in the name of Jesus. That was how people started listening to him. Yemi says, and Yemi ma. You will cry now for the Holy Ghost. There was something on that man that was present. That every other presence had to run. Holy Ghost, invade my privacy. Amen. Holy Ghost, invade my privacy. Amen. Am I communicating here? Yes, sir. Lift your voice. Repeat after me. Someone say, Father, Father send now, now. an outpouring out of, of your spirit. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. invade me. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. invade me. Holy Ghost, invade me. Lift your voice. Open your mouth. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Holy Ghost, invade me. Shada Pada Baya. Rede de 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 sha. Rede de 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 sha. E Kabala Gadaya. Holy Ghost, invade me. Invasion, invasion. E Kabala Balagadaya. Reka sita bada yo Invasion, invasion Invasion Invade my mind Invade my body Like a cloven tongue of fire Sit on my head, oh God Hey, shut up, Where is the Holy Ghost? Mr. Holy Ghost, invade me Hey, hey Hey, shut up, Open your mouth and pray Invent me. Invent me. Invent me. Hey, Kabadaya. Jabalagadabaya. Invent, invent. Like a mighty Russian wind. 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 Jabalagadabaya. Rede de 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 de. Invasion, invasion, invasion. In the name of Jesus. We will take that prayer one more time. I don't think you understand. Acts 10, 38. How God anointed Jesus of Nazareth first with the Holy Ghost and then power before he was capacitated, habilitated to go about doing Good. You can't do good in 2024 
without the Holy Ghost being the captain of your flight. Mm. Holy Ghost, invade me. Amen. I want to walk like God on earth. Sir. You are God. This man sat on a tree without saying a word. A whole juju that has been there for hundreds of years packed his load and left without packing his everything. I'm sure the juju didn't even have clothes on. Because all I saw was it was full, fully painted black as he ran out. How can your neighbor be practicing witchcraft and be convenient and comfortable in the environment? And you are there. You should be returning in January. And you hear that the man packed out. Yes, sir. Packed out, leaving properties behind. That you can now take if you want. Yes, sir. I wanted to get married in 2010. Mm. As I took this, I took my wedding invitation. Many of you that want to marry or do things you think that your pastors are not important don't mind all these pastors all these pastors they want to control your life all these pastors they want to do this I am fine with my bible uh, you know like they saw on, on youtube now I will read my bible I tell my, my church is in my house the bible you are reading is the ministry of somebody the, the book of Matthew open Matthew chapter 1 Matthew chapter 1 the front page How many of you have good Bibles? Not the one you borrowed or the one that is just picked up cheaply. Mama, what does the Bible say in front, the front page of Matthew? Please, please, can we put mic? Mama, what's get the mic down? Oh, come, just quickly, quick, 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 come, just come. Please, this is your Bible. Is it borrowed? No. List it? No. Stole it? <laughs> Is yours? Yes. You study? Yes. Okay. What is the first thing on the first page of the book of Matthew? The gospel according to Matthew. The, the gospel? According to Matthew. The word, key word there is according. Mm. Everything you read about Jesus in Matthew is according to his account, encounter and account. Yes, sir. Mark, if you go and check as well, it says the gospel according to Mark. Luke, yes, the gospel according to Luke. Mm. John, the gospel according to but guess what? Mark, Mark, Matthew, Mark, Luke is according to man. John is according to spirit. That's why he became divine before, died, before he died. But what I'm trying to say here, sirs and mans, is this. They say, oh, honest and passion. They don't, don't want to control your life. No, we don't want to control your life. In that same Bible now, in the realms of the spirit, I am part of the third covenant. It's called the third testament. Which is the now actions of the church. Yes, sir. So what I'm preaching is the gospel according to John Enuma. Mm. Of Jesus. I took my wedding card in 2010. Wedding invitation card. To one of my the pastor friends that was in Nigeria then. I said, sir, please provide this thing. I want to get married. The moment I dropped the wedding card, he threw it away. He said, hey, what is this? So what is this? At the time, I had not um, opened it. So he said, uh, he said Did you, uh, are, you, are you announcing an obituary? I said, obituary. I said, go for it. I want to get married. Want, this is my wedding invitation. He said, no. In the spirit, some people have converted it to an obituary. So if I had shared it out, it's like me sharing my death. Wow. For people to come bury me. So he said, leave it here. So we prayed. He said, you now, John, go home. As you get home, lock your bedroom. And go into three days dry fasting and prayer. That God should send this arrow back to the center. And if I be a man of God. He said two of your father's brothers will die. Because they planned it. I said what do you mean? He said every time God speaks. God will give us a sign. He said they wanted you to die. On the 6th of June. I thought this was in the month of May. I was giving him an invitation card. He said, I thought he was joking. But thank God I obeyed. As soon as I got home. I locked myself three days. Praying up, but guess what? God so good did God so good as I came out of that prayers. I got home, entered my sitting room, my father's house. My father was crying in the sitting room. I said, That what happened? He said, Oh, son, I just got news that one of my brothers died. I said, Praise in the Lord. Always. He said, You are rejoicing over someone dying. I said, Daddy, you don't understand. That encouraged me. I went to pray more. Before the third day was over, sir. The second man died. I said, this is God. So I went back to my sister. This is what happened. He said, be careful. 
Stay alert, be vigilant and sober. Sir. On June the 6th, I went to Ikorodu. Those of you that are Nigerians, you know Ikorodu. I went to collect, is it Ashwabi? Ashoki, sorry. From my in-laws, that is the traditional way to sow. I was coming back from Ikorodu. A new Land Rover in Nigeria, clean. The car just stopped at Maryland. I said, what's going on? I called the mechanic. They said, nothing is wrong. They checked. They said, nothing is wrong. So the car started again. Please hear this testimony. The car started again. I carried on my journey. We went through Ikeja, went through Yanopaja. We got to a place called Super. The car just stopped in the middle of the road around to 11 in the night. Everywhere was getting dark. So we, my brother and I pushed the car to the side of the road. More than 10 mechanics came. No one could fix it. At this time, it got to one in the midnight. After midnight. Then some boys came with weed, Igbo. And they said, Oh, Benny, meaning, Oi, what are you doing here, fam? Move this car. If not, the next time we come back, we'll take your body, take this car, and sell the two. I thought it was a joke. Around 1.30, they came back. 15. They said, we'll give you five minutes to move this car. I picked up phone. I didn't know what to call. I called the pastor. I said, sir, this is what's happening. He said, where are you? I said, this is where I'm at. He shouted. He said, in the name of Jesus, nothing will happen to you. I said, why are you praying? He said, don't worry. I, I think he didn't just want me to be afraid. He jumped into his car. Luckily, he lived around the Yanokaja area, which was about 30 minutes drive. He said, don't worry, don't fear. Just enter the car, lock yourself in. No matter what happens, don't open the door. The man came with full speed, boom, turned up quickly, jumped out of his car. He said, did they touch you? I said, no. He said, do you know that this place you parked? He said, he pointed. At that point, there were about almost 30 of them. That is where Ayat killers and armed robbers used to meet in super before they go rob for the night. He said, I said, sir, you are a pastor. How do you know these people? Uh, you know, I started looking at me with one eye. <laughs> you know killer. <laughs> So as he was talking to me, trying to explain, one of them came and saw him and just prostrated on the floor flat. I said, sir, they even prostrated. Killer. <laughs> then he said, he told the boy, the boy Yoruba, I said, this one is my son. You people would have hurt me if you touched him. Not knowing that this man used to go to prison to pray for them and preach to them. That's how they knew him. Wow. And in, they told him where they meet. And the secret location is where I now said, the car stopped. So that was what made him jump. The man says, so what's wrong with the car? So they, they told him that um, he has been here. They are angry that, tell this boy, oh, he's very lucky. We had planned to butcher him. We want to sell his parts, his body parts, and the car that night. But we don't just know what was delaying us. So the man looked at the car. He said, ah. He just, <laughs> he just said, oh, wow. You know, some people, they walk with this ease. Uh, you walk with ease. Amen. He just went, he touched the engine of the car. In the name of Jesus. John, start this car. I entered the car. So one touch. The car started. He said, go home. I will follow you till you get home. So when we got to my father's compound, I said, I will see you tomorrow. My brother said, my brother was with me in the car. At that time, he had Pastor Paul, the same Pastor Paul. He had already weed his trouser. I said, see you. Oh. Sir, he said, John, I said, what happened? Today is the 6th of June. Remember what they wanted to be my obituary. Wow. Thank God, God has turned it to a ministry I'm sharing to the glory of his name today. Hallelujah! Please, when I say ask for the Spirit of God, after asking for the Spirit, now we're going to now receive power. Amen. This is where if you oblige me, sirs, we will pray for the people. Anyone, just as the Lord leads, just blessing the people and asking God for his power to be activated in them and through them. The first thing is the spirit of God. Lord, invade me with the Holy Ghost. Amen. Lift your voice, repeat after me, someone say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Invade me. Invade me. With the Holy Ghost. With the Holy Invade me, me with the Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost. Lift up your voice. Your Open your mouth and begin to pray. In 
invade me with the Holy Ghost. My heart, my body. Hey, hey, hey. The fire of the Holy Ghost, the power of the Holy Ghost, the Spirit of the Holy Ghost. Hey, the Spirit of God. Mr. Holy Ghost, invade, 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 invade my body, invade my heart, invade my soul, invade my spirit, invade me, Lord, invade me, Lord, invade, hey, invade. Invade. Hey, hey, hey. Hey! Invade, 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 invade! Invade my body, invade, invade! Shakatabala Gadabaya! Lift up your hands now. This is the part where you say, Lord, Lord, let power be activated through me now. Let power be activated through me now. Let power see, power is not by the size of your body, power is by the size of who is in you, the force that is moving through you. You put zinc battery and energizer battery, there is different power. There is what we now call rechargeable battery. That when you die, you can still recharge it. That when you're weak, you can bounce up, recharge by grace and strength. Yes, sir. Through the joy of the Lord. Mm. Lift up your hands. Yes, sir. Sirs and mans, please, if you will step forward and just oblige us. Please. Those of you that want, you want, you know, you know, you are tired of Deliverance service every Friday. Deliverance service every Tuesday. When are you going to be the deliverer of those who are in, in captivity? Mm. You want your 2024 to be different. Sir. Instead of being delivered, you want to be the deliverance minister. Yes. You are trusting God for a new voltage. Amen. Dunamis power of God. Sir. You are trusting God. You are trusting God. Do you have an extra mic as well? You are trusting God. Please, wherever you are, this is an hour to pray. Because as the spirit moves here, yeah, through prophetic entrances, laying on of hands, those of you on Zoom, this is no barrier. You know, we always reach out to you. As the Lord moves, we'll get to you by the grace of God. Turn on your cameras wherever you are. If your cameras is short, you stay short up. Please, sirs and masks, can we just step forward and face the church? And if whatever you, the prayer you are trusting God for, and please, if the Lord lays in your heart to go lay hands on someone or to go and maybe to prophesy to someone or to speak to them, please just follow the leading of the Spirit of God. All, pro all protocols is broken here. As long as bondage, strongholds are broken. Lift up your hands. Breathe on me. Oh, breathe. On me, me, Holy Ghost, power and fire say, breathe on me. Yesterday is gone, say, yesterday is gone. Today I believe, Holy Ghost. Walk in me, oh, oh, walk in me, say, Holy Ghost, I say, walk in me, yesterday, say, yesterday. you are 
feel free to just come forward. You want you are trusting God for a new. You're not coming here just to receive a word of prophecy or what God the Spirit of God says. The Lord will always speak to us. But you are also stepping up because Lord, I want to be high voltage of power. Sir. Upon my return back home tonight, as I enter 2024, power. Please step forward if you want. To, if you want to, one of the ministers here to pray for you, to lay hands on you, to speak to you, to just impart you. Please step forward quickly. Feel free. Feel free. And as the Spirit of God moves, as the Spirit of God moves, please, sirs and mas, feel free to feel free to go into the crowd, sirs and my pastors and pastor missus, feel free to go into the crowd and just pray for the people and speak to them and prophesy to them. Say hey, hey. Yesterday's gone Say Power Fresh, 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 fresh Power, grace, grace, grace. Yesterday, Shabalaga Dabaya, they are made. Breathe, 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 help, help, help. Yes, yes, yes. The Holy Ghost is here. Holy Ghost. Yes, today, say, Mashakatabaya. Today, Holy Ghost. Breathe, 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 breathe. Breathe, 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 breathe. 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 A fresh and pouring sea. Shabalagadabaya. Yesterday, yesterday, oh, shall help her, help her there, help her up, help her up. Say, wherever you are, virtually, just lift your voice, virtually, begin to pray that the Holy Ghost finds you with a word of encouragement, a word of lifting, a word of deliverance, a word of impartation, impartation. Say, 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 say. Yesterday for 2024. Today I'm in need. For 2024. Holy Ghost power. Prophet Strich, what is the Lord saying there? What is the Lord saying there? Please feel free to step forward. You want to all protocols are broken. You know why you are here. Shabalagadabayadada. If the Lord is speaking, please let us know. We want to know what the Lord is saying. The mics are with you, please. Ministers, feel free to minister to them, please. Fresh out for it. Hey, Shadabalagadabai. New out for it. Out for it. Out for it. Out for it. I voted. I voted. I voted. I voted. I voted. Shy. Rain on me. Rain. Rain, 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 rain. The rain of your power. Your power. Your power. Your power. Yesterday, say, yesterday's gone. Today, I'm in need. Holy Ghost power. Rain on me. Rain, rain, rain. Rain, rain, rain. Rain, rain, rain. Rain, rain, rain. Rain on me. Say, yesterday's God. 
So Brendan, is the Lord speaking there? Yeah? Okay. Please let us know when the Lord is speaking. Holy Ghost power. Antoinette, come. Because of time. Stand here. Lift your hands. A new dimension of power. We go to Barbados now. You're going to be a new unction to be a deliverance minister. We want to start casting out devils yes, out of Barbados. Amen. From Christchurch to Bridgetown yes, to St. Michael, St. Philip's, yes. St. John, I prophesy. Lift hands. Holy Ghost, by the power invested, invader, take in the name of Jesus. But this moment, you, sh you begin to move with a new manifestation of the Holy Ghost Amen. like never before. Amen. I decree now a new unction. Take it. You begin to move. You begin to move. You begin to move from the crash head. Take. You begin to move. You begin to move. The Lord will use you beyond beyond your own capacity. You become a vessel carrier of something that is overdose, overdose, high voltage. Lord, I am praying now for an electric wave from the crown of her head to the sole of her feet. Now, take in the name of Jesus. Take in the name of Jesus. Take in the name of Jesus. When you lay hands on the sick, the sick will be healed. You touch the blind, the eyes will open. Those who are possessed by devils, as you walk in, the devils will run. Take it in the name of Jesus. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. Yesterday, say, yesterday's gone. Today, say, help out there, help out there, please. Rain, 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 rain. If you know that there is a gift in you that's been lying dormant and you're trusting God at 2024, you want your gift to come out. Come out, please step out. There is a project in you, there is something in you. You know that you, you dream, you sleep, you know that you, it's like in your dream life, you see yourself a giant. But when you wake up, things are looking small. Come out, I want to pray for you quickly. Please step forward, step forward. Just three steps forward quickly. Let's bring them forward. They're not too close to me, sir. Say we yesterday say yesterday. Step forward, come here, please. Step forward. I want to pray for you. Just line up, line up in front. Lift up your hands. Say please. Let's let's bring them this way. So that because of the main self God there. Now lift up your hands quickly, lift up your hands. Please, Pastor Brennan, if the, as the Lord is speaking, don't just, you know, all protocols are broken. As long as people are blessed tonight, it's a night of power. I want people to receive something home. Different voltage of the grace of God. Those of you online, a media, can I please? Let's slide through the let's slide through the pages so you can see those who are online. And please, pastors, we have people online as well on Zoom TV, so we can minister to them as well, please. Whoever the Lord leads you to, please let me know. We'll get them up. Now, all of you here, lift your hands. I want you to hold the hand of your neighbor to your left and to your right. Let's make it in rows. Because of, we can use space. Let's watch the man of God there, please. Quickly. Step forward, please. Step forward. Then give one meter, one meter, one meter, one meter gap. Now lift up your hands. Now you're going to pray. Father, I'm asking. Apostle Paul taught Timothy. He said, now don't neglect that which was set up in you by the laying on of hands. It's an error. Remember, everything that is in you is a gift of God that has been put in you. The talents, one multiplied 10 to 20. It became ruler over cities through multiplication. You are going to pray now. Lord! Touch me that the gift of God in me is stirred up for 2024. Lift your hands up. Now I give you 30 seconds to ask. Lord, touch me that the gift of God in me is stirred up. Lord, touch 
me, touch me that the gift of God, the gift of God in me, me is stirred up, up for 2024. For 2024. Lift your voice, begin to pray. Now ask him, ask him after 30 seconds. Quickly. Please begin to pray, begin to pray. Ask him the gift of God. The gift of God. My gift must receive the lift tonight. The gift of God, the gift of God. The gift of God, 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 the gift of God. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, find them now. The three of them you activated. One, two, three, take that's one. Activate, take it, activate it, activate it, activate it, activate it. The gift of God, activated. The gift of God, the gift of God, power activated. Power activated. Power activated. Activated, activated. The gift of God in you. Power, you will move. Listen. That prophetic, there is something prophetic on your life. I declare and I declare that oh. even now the gift of God yes, is activated in you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 2024, you will not just be carrier, but you will be a user of what you have carried. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And so shall it be. Yes, Lord. As the Lord leave it. Amen. In Jesus' name. Yes, Lord. Sirs, we have people online that I want us to be a blessing to. Please, let's pick that up. I want us to be a blessing to. Whoever the Lord um, lays in your heart to speak to, we know how to get there. Get them to be audible and we'll pray. Please just speak to them because we want them. This is our Zoom television. We want them to be blessed as well. Please, 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 as a man, please. Holy Ghost power, say, on me. say, yesterday's yes. gone. Today, brother Roland, Roland. His name is um, Roland. Can you hear us? Well, Roland, I decree to your life that you step into a new level. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever has delayed you up to now, mm. they let you go now. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever has hindered you, Shabalaga no dabai. longer hinders you. <laughs> In the name of Jesus. Amen. The hand of God comes down upon you mightily. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Receive a fresh anointing. Amen. Amen. Receive fresh grace. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. The grace of God will abound unto you. Amen. Amen. Abundantly. Amen. Amen. For favor. Amen. For joy. Amen. Amen. For peace. Amen. Amen. For prosperity. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. Yes, Lord. Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. So that was 100 percent Even just yesterday, he came for the service at the door. He says, sir, I know that I'm being delayed. The many things are distracting me. Even he, he shared a testimony. One of his, his one of the testimony. How many years, Brian Roland, was he trusting God for his um, papers? Was it 20? Um, two, how many years? Huh? Can we hear him? 15 years. That was the first delay. This man you're saying there's a call of God on his life. Delay. So that is 100 percent And it is done in Jesus' name. Come on, let's give the Lord praise. Please, whoever the Lord lays in your heart, please, we want to be a blessing to as many people who can reach. That brother there, what is your name? You raise your right hand. You, yeah, you looking back. You, what's your name? Raise your right hand. What's your name? I can't hear him. George. Lift your right hand. No, pray for that man. Amen. Amen. Please, Sas Amas, when you see anyone, just let us know so we'll allow you to minister to them as well. Just, just give us a minute. Who is the Lord speaking to? Huh? Blossom. Blossom. Where's Pastor Mrs. Blossom online? Blossom, she's there. Yes, sir. Blossom, she's over your media. Pastor Trish, she's, she's one. Just. Oh, she's there now. Is the mic on? Father, we thank you for the life of your woman servant, Lord God Almighty. Yes, Lord. I'm drawing you out of some limitations that the enemy has placed around you. Yes, Father. And in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, by the Spirit of the living God. Father, I thank you, Lord God Almighty, in the name of Jesus, Son of yes, the Lord. living God. I pull you out of every limitation that I see around you. Amen. I see where the enemy has brought confinement. There are certain blessings that the Lord God Almighty has already released into you. Yes, but the enemy has come with confinement. Mm. And in the name of the Jesus Christ, Son of the living God today, Lord. I decree that confinement is broken. Amen. I decree that confinement.
assignment is broken. Amen. I release the power of the Spirit of the Living God Almighty. Yes. To go forth. Your secret enemies will be revealed in the name Amen. of Amen. Them that fight against your destiny will be released. Amen. Will be revealed by the Spirit of the Living God. Amen. And I decree in the name of Jesus, speed will come to you. Amen. Speed will come to you. Amen. Access be granted in the name Amen. of Jesus. Access be granted in the name of Jesus. Amen. The blood of Jesus has already prevailed. Amen. Your enemies will see a table prepared before you. Mm. They will see that table. You will feast in front of your enemies. Amen. You will feast in front of them. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I decree it's over your life. Amen. Hallelujah. And so shall it be as the Lord live it. Yes, In Jesus' name, we agree saying amen. Amen. Can we, have the, can we have the pages all open so that we can get those who can be ministered to as well? Please, those of you in-house as well, don't just look. One word. It takes a moment. Sir? So please don't disconnect at this moment, point in time. Please, sirs and mans, whoever the Lord is laid in it. Let's, can we slide through the pages as Hallelujah. well? Hallelujah. Let's. Lord. Let's speak to Dion Harriot. Amen. That name keeps highlighting to Dion Harriot. Dion Harriot. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise Amen. The Lord. Dion, we want to prophesy to you now in the name of Jesus. The 2024 will be a year of release of the divine supernatural favor and visitation of the Spirit of God uh, in your life like never before. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We decree, we declare what has held you back shall hold you back no longer. Amen. We decree and we declare in the name of Jesus that God uh, shall lift you up. Uh, Amen. We decree, we declare unusual favor. Amen. Amen. Yeshua, hallelujah, Father. I see unusual favor coming to this woman, hey. hallelujah. I see men and women coming to favor you, amen, from unusual uh, places, amen. amen. Uh, and the blessing of God shall be released to you uh, in this season coming, uh, Saint the Lord, uh, in Jesus' name. Amen. amen. Hallelujah. Praise the name and of the And so Lord. shall it be, and we agree, as we call it done in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Bless you, Dionariot. It is done, yeah, you've been located. Amen. amen. Hallelujah. Can we find um, Agbola Samson? Agbola Samson? Yes. Agbola Media, Samson. Agbola Samson? Yes. And I just, I mean, I, I saw his name earlier just before he started praying. And I want to decree to you in the name of Jesus mm. that this is your season. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Rakele Bukodandikade Bukushanda Lada Bukodandikadaba. Resile de Bukodandikade Kashanda Le Bukodandikade Bukosende Kende Rede Bush. Your secret tears are wiped away. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Your secret tears are wiped away. Amen. Amen. No more sorrow in your life. Amen. Amen. You are exchanging your sorrow for laughter. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Every cloak of sorrow, Slow. of sadness around you, they are removed. Amen. Instead, you are covered with cloaks of joy. Amen. Of celebration. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. You begin to celebrate. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Everything you've been waiting on God for, it is now time. Amen. Amen. Your time is now. Amen. God turns to you now. Amen. And it begins to favor you. Amen. It begins to catapult you. Amen. Amen. Ah, above all your mates, we are mentored, they have left Shock behind. You overtake them. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. Amen. Amen. Rejoice. Yes, Lord. Don't be afraid. Mm. Be confident. Amen. In the God that you serve. Yes, Lord. He will attend to you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. Yes, Amen. Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Come on, let's give the Lord praise in this house. Hallelujah. Um, your name, George. Lift up your right hand. I want to pray for you. I saw a restaurant on your hand. At the same time, I saw young boys. These young boys, I see them playing in a field, like sports. Mm. But I saw God then connecting what is this restaurant with what is these boys, or what are these boys, or who these boys are who are playing football. The Lord said, you are going to feed young men. Mm, amen. But I want to pray for you because even you, you need help to be fed. Mm. 
in the sense that the enemy has weaponized powers to, mil to militate against your rising. Mm. There is so much possibilities in you. But do you know that the reason why this is happening is behind all of this from restaurant to sports and whatnot is a ministry that's evangelistic on your life. If you don't understand what I'm saying, just tell me so I'll break it down to you. It's a ministry that is evangelistic. Meaning, you are wearing jumper but I see a suit and a tie and I see a Bible and I see a mic in your hand. You can wear jumper, wear t-shirt, but God knows who he called. Mm. We're an evangelist, you. You hear a preacher of the gospel. There's a call on your life. What do you want to say? I'm a singer. Also, I'm an Odin worker. Evangelistic ministry is your call. There's a mic in your hand, a Bible. I see a, I see a tie. The militations you are experiencing. Have you heard of marine spirit before? Do you know what marine spirit is? That is the kind of power that's been weaponized to fight you. You've got to pray. There are some, there are some destinies that hell don't want to see birth because of the vitality and importance of that ministry to generations. And because God has sent you to be a lifter up of young, young men. Young, young men. Remember that the young ones are the arrow shot into the future. If they, if they are cut off, there's no future. So that's why the attack is strong. You must really pray because your ninth hour is when your attack is at its peak. Your blessing is stolen in the dream. Your ninth hour is when you should turn to the day. In the day, you should rest because things will work at ease when you have won the battles in the night. Your dream life is where they come to steal your blessings. What is meant to get to you in the morning? The enemy steals this in the night. Wow. Between the hours of 1.30 and 2.45, turn it to your night vigil every day. Mm. Because that is a time the enemy comes and reprograms what is meant to get to you the next day. Wow. It's time to shake out wickedness from the operations of your day. It's time to speak Job 38.12 into your life before you wake up in the morning. Between 1.30 and 2.45 is when the devil comes to take from you. But today, that enemy that hijacked what God has proposed for your life, I fire that devil from oppression. Amen. Your desires all you will acquire Amen. by the power of the Holy Ghost Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. And so shall it be as the Lord leave it yes, in Jesus' name. I want you to really pray. I want you to really pray. Because this marine attack, it's the oppressions of jacking your blessings mm. is one battle. Marriage is another battle. So, to stay married is another battle. Mm. When you have your daughter, you have to be careful and pray so that she's not an attack. So she's not a target of attack. But you will not fail. Amen. 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 At some point, I don't see you staying in the UK. I see you packing your bag. I see you leaving this country. I see you going to St. Vincent and the Grenadines. Wow. I see you ministering there. I see you going to St. Lucia. I see you ministering there. I see you going to Jamaica. I see you ministering there. But you must pray. For a fresh outpouring every season of the Holy Ghost. So I pray for you. Lift up your right hand. That the possibilities God has loaded that hand with. 2024 all shall manifest. All shall manifest. In the name of Jesus. Lift up your left hand. The authority in that hand. No devil will from this day be able to question you. Amen. No power shall from this day be able to question you. Amen. Thank you, my father. Thank you, Jesus. 
There is a bishop called Bishop. It's like, I don't know if his name is Francis. Mm. That God is going to link you up with. The Lord said, walk with discernment with him. He is not your Messiah, as in it's not the one that will change your life. Mm. But it will be an instrument to connect you with the ring. The, the let me, key ring that holds keys. He will connect you with people, certain people that will then do what God wants them to do. Mm. But when you first meet him, he will look as though this is the man. No. Know what God wants to use his life for and don't stop there. You will not fail. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Can I lay my hands on you quick? Take all the glory say we go. Take, 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 take. The glory, Jesus. Take all the glory, Jesus. We glory, glory. Well, what's the name? Cornelia. Cornelia. Is that Cornelia Smalling? Cornelia Smalling. You keep coming in and out of my screen. I don't know where you're from, but I hear the Spirit of the Lord saying, little but talawa. I don't know if you understand what that means to you, <laughs> but I know that... Can we have been, the sound on the stage for her? Change like the settings from my got, ears. You, 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 the Lord has called you to be great in stature, great influence. He's called you as a person of influence. Amen. You're not small. I feel like there, I know your name says smalling. But when I saw you without seeing all of that, I heard little but talawa. And in Jamaica, it means I might be small, but my butt. Amen. She's Jamaican. And for you, She's are you Jamaican? Is she Jamaican? Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. So you understand what little but talawa means. Amen. And hence the Spirit of the Lord told it to me in Patwa. So you can get the true essence of what it means. Amen. So I am today, by the mouthpiece of the living God, called you to greatness. Every, every assignment that the Lord God has called you to. I call you to greatness today in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, I thank you that thou, O oh Lord God Almighty, that today, God, your destiny, the greatness that you've planted yes, in Lord. Cornelia, Lord God, Almighty God, every restriction, every confinement from around her today, I call you to stand tall in the name of Jesus. Amen. I call you to stand tall in the name of Jesus. Amen. I hear the Spirit of the living God say, anything that you desire, go for it. Yes, Do not think that you cannot attain this thing. I hear the Lord God says, that which you have a desire, desire for push forward for it um, I have not put any limitation on you uh, says the spirit of the living God and he wants you uh, to arise and take confident confidence in him confident in who he has called you to be and arise to greatness in the name of Jesus uh, I release that to you today uh, I release that to you in the name of Jesus uh, father we honor you we bless you and we thank you for your daughter's life uh, and thank you Lord God for the gift that you have placed within her Lord. That today God Almighty begins to manifest her. She will know without a doubt that the hand of the living God is with me. Amen. And the voice of God has spoken into my situation. You will begin to dream dreams about the things that God is leading you into. Hallelujah. You will begin to dream dreams about the things that the Lord God is leading you into. Why? And he will direct you. Amen. Don't share them with any and everybody. Speak to God and the Holy Spirit about it. Because your enemy also has ears. He will hear this thing. And the same assignment that the enemy has placed around your life to restrict, to limit. You know, some names aren't a blessing. Some, lanes, some names are names that so you pray. You pray yourself out of that. Amen? Amen. Praise God. You pray yourself out of it. So to God be the glory Hallelujah. that you are great in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. So from today you are now called Cornelia Greatness. Hey. So you need to change it from Colonia Smalling to Colonia what? Greatness. Come on, let's celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. 
Hallelujah. Sirs, mass, please. Um, if the Lord, um, I mean, if, if the Lord has released you, please speak to them. If not, let let me know. I don't want to interfere with the flow. Amen. Let's all jump to our feet as well, please. Okay, that's it. Amen. Amen. Yes, Jesus. Come, let's celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Sazan. Thank you, Max. Amen. Li- lift up your hands one more time. Just lift up your hands. Ever so quickly, if you know that this 2024, uh, what's happening 2024 already? <laughs> This 2023 that is just gone, you suffer too much resistance. Mm. Too much. And in your heart, you are saying, "Mm, not for 2024. Just lift up your hands where you are. Too much resistance. Lift up your hand. Maybe it was a project, an expectation. Just lift up your hand. Something, something was just always resisting. Mm. Lift up your hand. The Lord is only going to touch seven people. I'm praying for seven, seven great testimony. Sir? So you can now include yourself. Uh, even on Zoom, every people raise hand. Okay. What? The Lord will touch as many as He wants to touch. Amen. Lord, I'm asking now, please lift up your hand. And I want you to picture the power of God. As you also picture that resistance being broken now. The Bible says the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. Lift up your hands. It's, it's, it's time you can't carry that load to, into 2024. That resistance must break now. The earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. The world and they that dwell therein for he founded it upon the seas and established it upon the floods. Who shall ascend into the hills of the Lord? Who shall stand in his holy place? Yes, sir. He that has clean hands, help her, help her, help her. And a pure heart who have not lifted himself unto vanity. Lift up your hands. The Lord is breaking resistance as I speak. He that has clean hands and a pure heart who has not lifted himself unto vanity nor sworn deceitfully, he shall receive a blessing from the Lord and righteousness from the God of salvation. Yes, Lord. Lift up your hands. Yes. Are you good? Yes, sir. Even lifted up, be he lifted up, be everlasting doors, that the King of Glory may come in. Yeah. Who is this King of Glory? The Lord strong and mighty, the Lord mighty in battle. Lift up your heads, oh ye gates, be he lifted up, he everlasting doors, that the King of Glory may come in. Who is this King of Glory? The Lord of hosts, he yeah. is the King of Glory, Shalom. In the name of Jesus, Amen. I decree. Every resistance, yes, as your hands are lifted, hey. you are coming out of that resistance. Amen. The resistance is broken. Yeah, the resistance is broken. Amen. Whatever you are virtually, the resistance is broken. Amen. As long as you are under the sound of my voice, Holy Ghost, touch them now. Begin to break the resistance. One, two, three, touch them. Break it, break, 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 break. Help out there, that's it there. Help out there, help out there. Break it, break it. The resistance is broken. Break, break. Break. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Thus says the Lord. It is over. Break. It is over. It's 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 over. It is broken. Your season of power has come. Your season of grace has come. Power. It is broken. 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 Resistance is broken. Resistance is broken. No more delays. 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 As long as you are connected, you are related. You are committed, affiliated, associated to this altar. I prophesy speed has come. I don't think the head that says speed has come. Power for accomplishment and establishment. Receive it now. Amen. The Lord said compensation has also come. Amen. Compensation has also come. Amen. Compensation has also come. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And we say amen. amen. Come on, let's give the Lord another clap offering. Hallelujah. Let's give the Lord another clap offering. 
you move mountains you cause wants to fall sir with your power you perform miracles the real the peace the zero zero i will stand in it only because you made you move mountains 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 you cause wants to fall with your power power sir you perform Nothing, nothing, nothing. That's impossible. I was standing here only because you made. Hallelujah. Please let's lift up a seed in our hands quickly. Quickly. Let's put a seed in our hands. This seed is a point of contact. Now, this seed is Lord, power in my finances. A seed in our hands. Quickly. Power in my finances. Quickly. Hold it up. Bro, Anthony, please stand up, sir. I, I, I just looked at your wife and I saw something just erupted mm. from the ground. The Lord said, 2024, I see you building a five-bedroom house. Amen! A house. It's but it's not going to be, I didn't see it in Africa. I didn't see it here. I saw it in the, is it the Hungary, Austria? She's, of, she's from Hungary. Hallelujah. I saw it in Hungary. I see you building a house. The stone that was used to build this house was not red stone. See, it, was, it wasn't square bricks. It was, um, I don't know how to describe it. It's like rough stones with cement. And I saw this house right. I didn't see bricks. I don't know how the houses are there. I didn't see, I didn't see square or rectangular shape. You know, the typical building blocks. It was a different type of stone I saw them using five bedroom I am prophesying now come Slow. Adam come the financial resources please come let me play for two of you the muscle for this to become a manifested miracle yes, Lord. the power of the Holy Ghost will give you speed yes, Lord. that before October next year Amen. this world would have manifested Amen. Father, I thank you. Thank you, Father. For I know it is done. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Now the door is open. Amen. Walk through it. Yes, Lord. It is done in Jesus' name. Amen. Come on, let's celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Let's put the seat in our hands quickly. Let's give the Lord our time is fast spent. Let up the seat above your head. I'm going to pray for you. Father, I'm thanking you for this precious moment. I pray, oh God, Lord. that as the seed of your people touch this altar, I am praying that Lord, you will permanently alter every financial flow that has brought pain but you now begin to action overflow that will bring gain in the lives of those who connect right now in the name of Jesus I am praying that Lord throughout 2024 let this seed be an altar that is raised that you will find the respect for the Bible says in Genesis chapter 4 verse 4 and God had respect for the offering of Abel, I pray that Lord our giving tonight, this seed that touches the altar will attract your respect the seal and the stamp of your respect thereby making us men and women of financial authority and authority in our financial lives. Lord I thank you for I know it is done and I thank you that and that when we call on you, you answer us as our good father in Jesus name and we say amen. amen please I want you to in all of the form please you rush forward the ministers first we drop their seat or, and then everyone else can follow ushers we know the routine God bless you you move mountain sir with your power sir there is nothing 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 sir say 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 that's, that's impossible, impossible. We make a miracle walk, a promise keeper, light in the darkness, my God. That is who you are. Oh, wait, we can say, we make a miracle walk, promise keep, light in the darkness. That is who you are. Please, those of you trying to use your cards to give your, your seeds.
the, the, there's an officer at the back who will use the PS machine to receive your seed. God bless you. Everyone giving electronically, grace is multiplied unto you. We make a say, we make miracle worker, promise keeper, light in the darkness, say, say. That is who you are. We make a say, we make a miracle worker, promise keeper, light in the darkness. Say, we make us say, 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 miracle walk, promise keep, light in the darkness. That is who you are. We make us say, we make us say, miracle walk, promise keep, light in the darkness. Hallelujah. Let's stretch forth our hands to the altar. Father, we thank you for what has been dropped. I'm praying, Lord, that this is now a sacrifice that is risen into your presence like a sweet smelling offering that it is. And I pray that you accept our giving. And I pray that in return you send good, you send men of timber and caliber with good measure, pressed down, shaken together, run over in form of that financial blessing. Let them give back to our bosom. And we vow to return the glory. As we use our finances wisely in Jesus' name, and we say amen. 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 Um, Minister, can we? Minister, can we clear this quickly? Now, let's be seated two minutes. Tomorrow is the baptism. So, those of you who have been going through the baptismal class and those of you who made your intentions known to be baptized, baptism will be taking place tomorrow, 3 p.m. Yeah. Huh? Okay, is there, should we make it a bit closer to the service? When? What time? Okay, 5 p.m. Sorry, head of operations. I've been corrected. 5 p.m. Don't come at 3. You'll be alone with the angels of God. So, 5 p.m., please arrive early. Come with change of clothes. Come with your own towel. <laughs> and please bring cloth. Wear something that is not revealed. Don't want to dip in water and we are closing eyes after baptism. <gasps> Please put on something that is underneath your white where you wear, and when you come out, you can still say praise God. <laughs> we had baptism in Luton one day. This was what year was that? 2018 or so. As soon as people came out of water, the Holy Ghost took all of them. So some people didn't dress properly. We had to start doing damage control. <laughs> we don't want damage control. Amen. Amen. We want to be free in the presence of God. So, so tomorrow, baptism will take place at 5 p.m. Those of you, you know your friends and families are baptizing. It's a, it's a thing of joy. You can come around and then, you know, um, rejoice with them as they get baptized and dipped in and by immersion. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Hallelujah. Please, um, that's not what you should do. That's not what you were struck to do. Amen. So um, that, that would be 5 o'clock tomorrow. And please, um, before um, we start the service tomorrow, tomorrow is going to be our fourth of, of five nights. Please, I'm going to give an instruction towards our crossover service. Please, begin to write your 24 expectation. Not one more, not one shot. 24 expectation for the year 2024. Our crossover service is going to start on Sunday night. 
Our crossover service will start on, some, on Sunday night, 7 p.m. So Don't forget, so the crossover service is the New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve service. New Year's Eve service will start um, 7 p.m. on Sunday. So please don't forget to be here early so you're not, be, you're not disappointed with the sitting arrangement. 7 p.m. we start the New Year's Eve service. Sir, Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Please, Pastor, where are you? Pastor Philip, please. You forgot yourself? <laughs> so don't forget, we're going to drop our 20, 2024 expectation sheet on the altar during the crossover service. Those of you watching virtually, prepare yours as well. 2024, 24 expectations, 24 things you want God to do for you in the year 2024. Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Let's rise up so we can pray and share the grace. Caricia, Caricia early there. Raise your right hand. I want to pray for you. I just feel led to pray for you. Father, I'm lifting up. Caricia, early day. There you go. Father, I'm thanking you for your daughter and I'm praying for a new dimension of your blessing. Can you say, I'm praying that 2024 shall be your best year yet. Amen. I'm praying for an, op an opening that will take you out to, the, to Northern America that will then give you finances to execute great projects in your own country. I won't mention a country for preservation's sake, but I'm praying for you. Father, give your daughter supernatural speed. Amen. Surprise her that before the month of May 2024, so, this world would have already been actioned in Jesus' name. Amen. And we say amen. Amen. Lift up your hands and release a blessing over your life. So, I'm praying for everyone who's connected tonight. We have gathered uniquely, gathered specially gathered with our hearts crying to God for the year 2024. Sir. Father, I pray that your blessing rest upon us. Amen. May the Lord, and just as Eli said, he says, now the Lord God of Israel grant thee thy request and thy petition. Eli told Anna, by the next Shiloh, Anna had given birth to Samuel. Sir. Listen, I pray for you. By this time, when we meet in 2024, yes, Lord. all of your 24 prayer requests you will bring here on New Year's Eve, hey. all of them would have manifested. Amen. All of them would have materialized Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. And so shall it be yes, Lord. in Jesus' most precious name. I will say amen. amen. Tomorrow we're going to be receiving the ministration of one of our guest pastors. The service starts at 6 p.m. And we also look forward to our New Year's Eve crossover service, which is on Sunday so, at 7 p.m. So tomorrow, Saturday, 6 p.m. Sunday, New Year's crossover service starts at what? 7 p.m. Please arrive early so that you're not disappointed with your sitting arrangement. God bless you. Someone say, surely. Surely. God's goodness. God's goodness. God's mercy. God's mercy. Follow me. Follow me. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. And I vow, and I vow to, dwell to dwell in the house of the Lord. In the house of the Lord. Forever and ever and ever. Forever and ever and ever. In Jesus' name. In Jesus now, name. someone say, I, I have, received have received the charge. The charge. To walk. To walk. In divine authority. In divine authority. So by the power of the Holy Ghost. So by the power of the Holy Ghost. 2024. 2024. Here I come. Here I come. In the name of the Lord. In the name of the Lord. God bless you and as if the credit shall be in Jesus' name. Amen. We we'll see you tomorrow, 6 p.m. Invite someone and tell someone about the last two nights of our five nights of glory. And I pray your last night remain the same. Everyone on television watching via Apostolic Television, watching via uh, Apostolic TV, Zoom, Instagram, and Facebook, and whatever platform you're connected this hour, I speak life over you and I pray grace is extended to you. Amen. In Jesus' name, most, in Jesus Christ's most precious name, so, I will say amen. God bless you. Amen. See you tomorrow, 6 p.m. And those of you don't forget, baptism, 5 p.m. tomorrow. God bless you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord.
Five Nights of Glory, Theme, Walking in Divine Authority, A Night of Power, Fire and the Dynamic Move of the Holy Ghost. Join us Wednesday 27th, Saturday 30th at 6 p.m., then Sunday 31st at 7 p.m., with our serving senior pastors, Apostle John and Prophetess Josephine Anuma. The Saints of God will be gathering at the Haven Global Church UK, Vincent Street, Canning Town, London, E161LZ. Tell somebody to tell somebody. Five Nights of Glory, Theme, Walking in Divine Authority, A Night of Power, Fire and the Dynamic Move of the Holy Ghost. Join us Wednesday 27, Saturday 30th at 6 p.m., then Sunday 31st at 7 p.m., with our serving senior pastors, Apostle John and Prophetess Josephine Anuma. The Saints of God will be gathering at the Haven Global Church UK, Vincent Street, Canning Town, London, E161LZ. Tell somebody to tell somebody. Do you incline to speak to the man of God in a more confidential setting that is away from the ears of others? This is your opportunity to book a one-to-one -one prophetic counseling with God's servant, Apostle John Enuma. This is where the mind of God is released concerning your life. Simply visit the website at www.johnenuma.com. Please note, the fee required is for administrative and software maintenance. You will receive an email of confirmation with the time and date for your prophetic counseling session. For further details, please contact the admin line at plus 447758230111. Thank you for watching. Do you incline to speak to the man of God in a more confidential setting, that is, away from the ears of others? This is your opportunity to book a one-to-one -one prophetic counseling with God's servant, Apostle John Enuma. This is where the mind of God is released concerning your life. Simply visit the website at www.johnenuma.com. Please note, the fee required is for administrative and software maintenance. You will receive an email of confirmation with the time and date for your prophetic counseling session. For further details, please contact the admin line at plus 447758230111. Thank you for watching. Five Nights of Glory Theme Walking in Divine Authority a night of power, fire and the dynamic move of the Holy Ghost. Join us Wednesday 27, Saturday 30th at 6 p.m., then Sunday 31st at 7 p.m., with our serving senior pastors, Apostle John and Prophetess Josephine Anuma. The Saints of God will be gathering at the Haven Global Church UK, Vincent Street, Canning Town, London, E161LZ. Tell somebody to tell somebody.